Hello and a very good afternoon. Good morning. Welcome to Crafters TV. My name's Ben Mosby. Thank you for joining us. I know already that there are hundreds of people tuned in specifically for this show. I know that already loads of you are uber excited because I can see all of the messages coming in on my tablet. And let me just tell you, you know I'm... I'm normally quite an excitable chap on any other normal day, but I have been waiting for this particular show since I first saw this little machine on uh, the HSM preview show, which was seems like weeks and weeks and weeks ago now. And I was saying back then, I really want to be the one who gets to launch this on Crafters TV. And here we are. The day has finally arrived that you've been waiting for. The day where we get to bring you the Gemini Pro OMG. I can't tell you how excited I am. Um, and I'll tell you what, I'm not here on my own. To share the excitement with me, I think possibly the most excitable person that I know on a normal day. Wait till you see how excited she is today. Sarah's in the house. This is amazing. Well, you know, when it's a big show, <clears throat> I like to pull rank. I, and let me just say, I pulled rank. I did the world launch over in the US a few weeks ago, Ben. I was live on Creating Craft yesterday. And now for the first time, you guys are seeing it on Crafters TV and we have a whole two hours to put it through its paces, which means whatever it is you want to know, you want to understand about the product, you want me to try, just ask Ben and I will do it live on air. There is nothing this machine cannot do. And if I tell you, Ben, right, it has been years in the making. So we developed this as a result of you guys asking us to. And no, it looks, it just looks like all the other Geminis. However, if I just get a regular size Gemini and put that on top of it, right? Now Lossy. you can see and appreciate. It just looks normal. It's it's a little bit like the big 75 inch plasma screen we've got in our living room, Ben. Yeah. It just feels so normal now. That's what we're used to seeing until you put a regular size TV in front of it and you realize how lucky I am to be sitting watching that 75 inch plasma screen every night. That is what the world is going to be like with the Gemini Pro. Now, the thing is to get from this to this, was it as easy as it might seem? It certainly wasn't as easy as we thought it was going to be, if I'm totally honest, Ben, because actually it's like if you normally drive a little Nissan Micra yeah. and then you move to driving a big 10 ton truck, right. your motor out of your little Nissan Micra is not going to power your big truck. No. It needs a new motor, it needs new gearing, it needs new engineering. That is what happened with the Pro. So you might just look and think, oh, it's only an extra three inches wide. Actually, the power it takes to power a machine over that size in that scale has meant the gearing, the motoring in this, the engineering is absolutely off the chart. I now understand, Ben, why nobody in the industry worldwide has made a 12-inch electronic machine up till now. I understand why, having been through that process myself. Now, all I would say is, if you are watching and you are one of the customers who have the Pro, please, please, if you haven't been using it, use this two hours to craft along with me. Do a lot of the same projects that I'm doing because that will give you a bit more of a feel and the confidence to go and use this. Share photos. I love nothing more than seeing the pictures that you have. I've seen some hilarious pictures, Ben, of this in people's craft rooms. Email studio at crafterscompanion.co.uk with selfies with you and your Gemini. I've seen some where people have decorated the Gemini. There you go. I knew in. it. Send them in. It'll be brilliant. You come and be part of our show and we'll do this together. I said to producer Erin before the show that I'm sure there is somebody out there who has taken their Gemini Pro, nicknamed it the Beast or something, and drawn a yes. face on the front of it with googly eyes. I'm not even kidding you. Um, producer Erin thinks that somebody should name their machine the Big Ben. I mean, I am up for that. If you're naming your machines, which I think you should, let me know if you're going to name yours Big Ben, because that, that would be very cool. Send in your pictures, though, as Sarah says. Um, you and your machine, we would love to see them. Let us see any projects that you've done so far with your Gemini Pro. Uh, and as I say, particularly if you've decorated your machine, too, with a big 
face on it. I definitely want to see that. Studio at craftiscompanion.co.uk. We've got so many hellos to do. Let me just do a quick few hellos and then I've got another exciting announcement to tell you which you might not have heard about yet. So hello to Suzette who's in, so excited. Felicia from Ohio, really excited. Katrina's in from Northampton. Um, Kerry's in saying very excited for this one. Nancy is excited, excited. That's how excited Nancy is. Patty says hello everyone from Michigan. Eleanor's in from Scranton, Pennsylvania. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Uh, Rebecca says good morning from Austin, Texas. I cannot wait to see this demonstrated. The comments are flooding in. We'll come back to those. But the excitement as well today is that today we have launched the details of our brand new schedule, which Ooh, launches yes. on Monday. It's our spring schedule. We mentioned this earlier on during Craft Vault. You guys love this, all right? So let me quickly run this through for you because it's really, really exciting. We can't wait to launch this. So as of Monday, next week, this is the new schedule for you. So the first show of the day is going to be 12 through until 1.30 UK time. That's 7 till 8.30 Eastern. I'll tell you more about that in just a second because that changes depending on whether it's a weekday show or a weekend show. 3 till 5 is your next show uh, or 11 till 1 Eastern and then 7 till 9 here in the UK uh, is the second show or 2 till 4 Eastern. These two show times here are all the ones that you know and love. Things like your launch days, things like your launch parties, your master classes, your Monday makers, all the shows that you know and love will be in these time slots. Now, a lot of people got a bit concerned earlier on going, hang on a minute, it's starting at 12. What's happened to the wake up call with Craig? Surely you've not booted him off. He's not done that badly. No, uh, the wake up call, we're giving him a bit of a lion is what we're doing. Because do you know what? As much as he loves having his own show, he's always going, oh, hey, the new, I have to get up early in the morning, hey. Uh, so we're putting it a little bit, that's how he talks. <laughs> <laughs> so we're doing do it. Do that again. Do that again. That was hilarious. He went. He went. The key, the new. I have to get up early in the morning. Hey, can you put me show a bit later? Hey. <laughs> And we went, aye, Craig, we'll put it at midday. And he went, aye, good job, aye. Um, so <laughs> midday, <laughs> midday uh, through to 1.30. And basically that show is going to be Craig fronting it. You'll see me and Joe popping up on that show as well, just to give him a bit of a helping hand. And then the final half hour, hour of that show um, will be sort of a fast paced craft vault show with loads of extra goodies on it. So that is Monday to Friday, uh, the new wake up call with Craig. What happens Saturday, 12 to half one, I hear you cry. Well, it is play your crafts right. Yes, play your crafts right. Well, it's going to be interactive. It's going to be fast paced. Loads of demos, but also during that show, your chance to interact with us and win prizes. Oh yeah, we said this earlier on. If you want to be one of our contestants on this show, get in touch with us now. Uh, studio at crafterscompanion.co.uk. Let us know that you want to be in on play your crafts right and we will feature you. We're going to give you the chance to win prizes and also very exciting on that show we've got something called the winner's circle uh, more will be revealed when we get round to that show saturday mornings and the other really really exciting bit of news is loads of you have been saying how much you love the softer side of life shows that we do but you were kind of like that on a sunday because sunday mornings a bit more laid back you know you want to be able to sort of like sew along and craft along with us so we've listened to what you said and do you know what we've said right we're going to do it on a sunday so the softer side of life now will be every sunday in this time slot uh, with bernie so you've got the ability to join along with us if you love your sewing if you love your quilting that is going to be the new time to kind of gently ease you into a Sunday and I think that is a perfect time slot that's what you've been saying to us and that is what we have done so that is the new schedule we'll keep reminding you of it uh, but it starts next Monday very exciting and also very exciting of course today is the launch day of the Gemini Pro and before we get into the demos and get answering your questions here is a little video which will explain more about this brilliant machine have a look Supersize your die cutting and embossing potential with the Gemini Pro. With a huge 12 by 12 cutting platform as standard, this machine is perfect, not only for larger projects and batch making, but also for cutting all elements, mats and layers for your smaller projects in one pass too. The machine is capable of cutting through all sorts of materials, including card, craft metal, leather, wood, felt, and multiple layers of fabric. The power, pressure and performance that you come to expect from the Gemini family of electronic die cutting machines has been enhanced to the next level. It's been engineered for superb edge to edge cutting of up to 12 by 18 size materials with perfect results every time. In the box along with your Gemini Pro machine, you'll receive two clear cutting plates, a rubber embossing mat, a magnetic shim, plastic shim and metal shim, all 12 by 12. Power cord, plus of course your comprehensive instruction booklet that will guide you through the plate combinations you need for your different dies and embossing folders. 
Larger 12 by 18 plates are also available separately to boost your creativity even further. So, whether you're a card maker, scrapbooker, create paper or fabric embellishments, table decorations, wedding stationery, or keepsake gifts, to name but a few, this machine will revolutionize your crafting experience. There you go, a bit of an overview there as to how brilliant this machine is. There is so much love coming in already. Sherry saying, good morning all. Gemini Pro is amazing. Susan Russia on Facebook, good morning, Sarah and Ben. Yes, Pro Launch, yes, woohoo, I love mine. I'm so excited for our UK friends to finally be able to get theirs. Whoa, says Rebecca, that is so much bigger. You don't realize it when it's sitting there by itself. The Pro, says Regina, is a beast. It's massive, yes. Betsy says, good morning from Houston, Texas. I got my Pro at HSN launch loving it so much uh, love the 12 by 18 plate says Regina we'll come on to those you can cut so much at one time so excited says Mary Pat good morning says Denise um, everyone short change breakfast for the family this morning did not want to miss a minute uh, and Carrie on Facebook says Ben is Craig a pirate or is he Scottish a bit of both um, <laughs> <laughs> the Gemini Pro is here. Grab yours today. 449 or 499.95. I'll do the maths on the, um, the deal on this if you are a Platinum member, by the way. It comes with 500 bonus points. All right? 500? <laughs> How many? Was 500. Was I feeling all right that day? That's Ooh. like two levels in the club if you're just getting started. But we do look after you guys, don't we? Uh, buy, buy, we do. Uh, it's 359.20 if you're a platinum member with your 20% off uh, in the UK. In the US, 399.96 um, if you're going this, getting this with your platinum, uh, which is just amazing. Now, it obviously comes with all of the plates that you need to get started, but we do have the extra plates for you as well. So let's give you the details on these because it's always worthwhile. You're not going to need these straight off the bat, of course, but it's always good to have more uh, for when you do need them. So the um, replacement plates, you get two of your clear cutting plates, you get your plastic shim, your plastic, uh, your, your storage bag included as well, your plate storage, that actually works out that you're getting that for free. So 44.97 or 50 59.85 is the and deal I'll on that. And I'll just explain, Ben, the so, reason I've done that bundle yeah. is because you, once you've, in, the, in your starter kit, in your Gemini, you get the metal plate, you get the magnetic, those are the ones, the, the rubber embossing shim, that you aren't going to need to replace as often. It's just having the extra set of the ones that take the pressure. Yeah. So the cutting plates and then also your frosted plate. That's why that bundle just has those three plates in so that you're not buying extras, folks, of stuff that I don't think you're going to need as soon. So trust me, I'm one step ahead of you looking after you. In contrast, though, look at the 12 by 18 set of plates we've done for you. You're going to need everything in that big size. Yeah. So you put two of the clear plates, one of the frosted, you've got your metal shim, your 12 by 18, and your rubber embossing mat in the 12 by 18. I will warn you, folks, you have almost cleared us out of these to start with. So many of you pre-ordered these when they went live on the site last night. Uh, and we're going to have to wait to get our next order in. So it's going to be a few months uh, we'll be out of stock of these. So if you already own the Gemini and you're thinking about getting some extra plates, please just get them while they're on offer, while you've got that great deal. But more importantly, while we've got them in stock, Ben. Yeah, I mean, stock level, I'm, I'm hearing, uh, you know, on this show already, um, stock levels of things gone like 65%, 70%. Things are flying out of the door already. Yeah, if you want to get these, $99.95 or $124.75, saving $19.99 or $24.95. I promise you we're going to get on to showing you this machine in just a second but one thing that we wanted to bring forward because we're really excited about launch party coming up later on this afternoon four o'clock uk time um, there's so many great things launching at the minute and this is another one of the things that i was really looking forward to the jigsaw dies are going to be here yes. later on however we've pushed it forward so you can grab these now before launch party at four o'clock You've got the 10 by 8 jigsaw die, comes with the mount board, already over 60% of the stock has gone. We might oh, not have a show on this later, Sarah, at this rate. 
I did not know that yeah. before we started the show. Let me tell you, it's going to be Jigsaw City today. <laughs> uh, we've got, honestly, the kids have had me making jigsaws galore, Ben. You know, since we've had this diagram. I can imagine. I know so many of you. On HSN, by the way, they sold out before the show. So based on Ben and I giving you the preview in that January preview day, it sold out before the show even happened. So how many of you out there have been waiting for us to get these in stock? We've got the 10 by 8 and we've got the 5 by 7 back in stock. We've done them on the bundle with the mount boards. You can then stock up on as many mount boards as you want. Uh, or just cut them out of your regular cardstock or some other clever things I'm going to teach you later on on this show. So, uh, yes, trust me, just get the jigsaws, get them checked out while we've got them um, because it sounds like they could be gone today. Yeah, and the good thing is, of course, if you get them now, you can then sit back and enjoy the show a little bit later on, not worrying whether or not you're going to be able to get your hands on them. The 10 by 8 with the mount board is, look at the deal again, 49.99, 59.95, launching it, and look, we're already taking off 17.99 or 19.95 off the price you should be paying they are phenomenal uh, and I'll, I'll tell the story again how about I think it was about two or three years ago uh, before I even knew about these I uh, sent a photo of my daughter with her pony that she had at the time off to a company to make a jigsaw for me I mean it was 40 quid just for that one jigsaw alone you can get this today for 49.99 or 59.95 and then you can make as many jigsaws as you want out of all the photos that you've got at home it is phenomenal if you want to go for the 5x7 that is also available for you as well once again that does come uh, with your mount board collection so grab this whilst it's here because the stock of the 5x7 is also flying out the door 29.99 or 39.95 um, over 50% of the stock has gone we've not even done the official launch of this yet ah you are savvy shop as I love this get ahead on the web as we always say saving 20% uh, and another 20% off that if you are a Platinum member. So before I hand you over to Sarah to have a look at this machine and put it through its paces, remember we want to see your pictures. US viewers, if you've already got this, tell our UK viewers why you love your Pro so much, what you've been using it for, why you find it so useful. Send us the pictures of you using it. We want to see it. If you've decorated your machine, let us know. If you've named your machine, uh, let us know. Uh, but get those pictures in studio at crafterscompanion.co.uk and also get commenting. Facebook and YouTube, you guys are the best people to tell everyone else and I, I'm talking to the US viewers again here tell our UK audience why you love your machine you know in the comments let us know and then we can read all of these testimonials out as well uh, and we can make it a nice and interactive uh, hour and 40 minutes because we're already 20 minutes in 20 minutes of excitement already uh, let's have a look though at this amazing machine in action Sarah where are we going to start okay so let me just tell you I'm going to dispel a myth right from the very very off right you don't need a 12 inch wide machine because we're going to launch a load of 12 inch dies. We will do some bigger dies, but it's not about that. It's about the dies you already have getting more for them. So, for example, how gorgeous does this here look, right? This lovely set of boxes. Wow. And it looks so incredible, Ben, because what we've done is we've been able to use our fabulous lace edgeable dies and cut around the edges of the boxes. That is impossible if you have, to, well, it's not impossible. You can do boxes this big. Yeah. If you have a regular Gemini, by the time you score up the side of the boxes, you can't do a meaningful size box. If you want to do anything meaningful, whether it's boxes like this, whether it's gorgeous scored boxes like this, Love whether that. it's your Envella boxes like this, Ben, yeah. everything with the cut in detail looks so much more professional. So I'm going to do like a little mini demo segment and show you all of these, right? So if I just start off, this cardstock, by the way, go, don't you go flying anywhere, gorgeous brand new cardstock in these summer sorbet Ooh, yes. colours. I'm going to pick out, I love this green. I mean, the su it's just summer sorbet. It's these lovely bright fun colours. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a box at two and a quarter inches. So I'm just using my big score or your score master would work in the same way. I'm starting with my 12 by 12 here, Ben, yep. and doing two and a quarter inches on all four sides. Now, you know I love edibles. We've got loads of gorgeous edibles in our collection already. But then what we've also done is we've done some brand new gorgeous, um, gorgeous dies. This one's lovely. And they're edibles, Ben, but they are optional edges, right? Okay. So you can either cut the outside or not. So this is the Regal Rick Rack one I'm using. I'm just positioning this into the side of my box. I'm going to hold this in place and we're going to send it through the machine. I love now, this. 
Let me get the plates out, right? Okay. These plates, if they're, I'm going to say they're exactly the same as your regular Gemini plates. They are and they're not, right? They are the same, but because of, you know, I've talked about the motor in here being so much more stronger, yeah. right? What we've worked out is we've managed to get a special hardener that we've injected into the plastic when we make the plates to make the plates be able to absorb the pressure from the stronger motor. Now, I know what you're going to ask. Can we put that in the current <laughs> plates that we're getting? Yes. The answer is yes. Oh. So we are absolutely going to look to try and inject that into the regular plates for our regular Gemini and the Gemini Junior. So Leanne is working on, and I can't give you an exact time frame, but I promise you that is going to be coming in that we are going to be getting extra, um, extra like hardened plates. But what it means is, these will last you longer. What I didn't want is, because they're bigger and they're more expensive, I didn't want you to feel like you had to keep replacing them every few months or something. So what we did was, we were able to, put, you know, after, it's been two years in the engineering this, you know, Ben. Yeah. We've been able to build that in. Look at these dies. Can we just appreciate how they just fell out of here? I mean, is that not just incredible? In terms of... In terms of your die cutting, that is seriously impressive. And it's all the machine, folks. So I'm just taking this, moving it to the next side. We're going to pop this together, right? And it's ready to go through again. Now, here's the thing. Um, the turntable that I'm using, by the way, we will be getting this. It's not in yet. We will be getting this in stock next month. So if you're waiting for this, uh, no, this won't fit on your uh, totally Tiffany turn, uh, rotating design board by the way before somebody asks or whatever uh, nice idea i've tried it it's a bit too big and heavy <laughs> right so at least i've i've trialed that one and preempted that question coming right these are just cutting like an absolute dream it's great then. to see how well this machine cuts as well because like you were saying if you were thinking to yourself oh bigger machine does that mean we're going to get you know less in the way of uh, like pressure and power because it's so big now you're seeing just exactly the kind of pressure and power that you'd expect from yep. all your gemini machines is in your pro as well which is great to know well, as ridiculous as it seems, it's it's actually, it's it's got more pressure. Mm. Now, the, the reason it's got more pressure, we put as much pressure as you possibly could into the regular size Gemini. To get something to cut over this space, we needed to upgrade the motor significantly to give you the pressure that you needed to be able to cut through that. So that's why, have you noticed it's a little bit faster as well? Mm. It's a little bit quieter. It's all to do with that upgraded motor. We couldn't get a motor of this size into your regular Gemini, works a dream in your Gemini Pro. Now, I'm very conscious, I want, I want to kind of speed these things up, right? But I'm, I'm taking time doing all this. Watch, once you've done this, by the way, on all four sides, all you're going to do in these corners is you're going to cut out the corner like this, right? Now, if I was to take these and fold this behind, you would see that behind there. Yeah. Doesn't look very good, does it not? So all you're going to do is you're going to just give yourself a little gluing flap like this so that we can glue that with the little gluing flap into place and you don't see it. Got you. So what I've actually done is, I've got the one here where I've done all four sides and you'll find I've done this with a lot of my demos. I've got so much to show you. I'm gonna try and speed things along to get through as much as possible. Now with your tape pens, your Crafters Companion tape pens are absolutely fine. So I'm just going through all four sides here. Little bit of tape onto there, Ben. Yep. And then these literally just fold over and stick under there now. If you're doing beautiful centerpiece boxes, if you're doing really big showcase pieces, I'm going to come on and teach you how to do things like your pizza style boxes a little bit. Pizza later. boxes? Pizza boxes. Oh, yes. Now, you're now you've got your... my attention. Oh, now I've got Ben's attention. <laughs> of course I have. Uh, if you're going to do things like that, you're going to need. The, um, the tw those 12, 12 by 18, by 18 plates, yeah. right? So if you're going to get those 12 by 18 plates, you'll be able to do that. I've just used here some of our... Um, this is just some of the Century Pearl card now for the base because you, I didn't need to use my fancy coloured cardstock for the base. I've just used my lovely white cardstock for the base. We have got loads of cardstock on the show for you as well. If you have a delve um, on our website, there's loads of um, cardstock for you to be able to pop into your basket uh, with your Gemini Pro. If you're liking the A3 though, uh, producer Erin just tells me that he's heading towards limited stock. We are really busy, unsurprisingly. Um, we're well, just hearing like the viewer numbers are going up and up and up and up. People, I think, uh, setting their alarm getting up and tuning into this show uh, because it is 
so super exciting. I just can't believe, just looking at the pile of boxes that Sarah had over there, uh, that you've got the ability to be able to make kind of projects of this sort of size as well. But for those of you who are into like, your batch making, your scrapbooking, maybe you've got a bit of a side hustle on your crafting as well. This machine, and that's why it's called the Pro, because it gives you professional results. Isn't that amazing? I know, and you it's can like see a little it, mini In the way box. that we've done that, mm. you could also do the same with that gorgeous big set. I mean, that to me yeah. is just the epitome of absolute professionalism. Absolutely. And any of your edgeable border dies, all you need to do though is you need that big size, right? Now, it's exactly the same. I'm gonna go straight from one into the next demo. I'm gonna be, this is why guys, it's been wonderful to have two hours. Look, I'm gonna get another piece of that lovely sorbet, summer sorbet cardstock, and I'm gonna bring this in. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to do this one here, right? Now, this here, sheet of 12 by 12, Ben. Here we go, math's coming out. 12 by 12, I want to split it into thirds. What am I scoring at? Third of 12? Four. Four, he's up there, right. So, all four sides at four inches, yeah. right? Now, we've got- The homeschooling's got... been paying off. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> we've got some absolutely gorgeous new dies, yeah. right? In the shot, so they come as like, with favour boxes, right? So there's sets of favour boxes that dies like this. And all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna position these across the top. So I'm just gonna stick these in place, Ben, and then we can send this through in the same way. Um, all of these boxes, by the way, I'll show you a little bit later on. Um, it, it's a lovely bundle of these little favour boxes that you can grab a whole assortment of different um, boxes for you. Just to show you, um, unsurprisingly, this is flying out of the door, particularly here in the UK. Loads of you are jumping on to grab this. It's a great machine. Remember, 449, but if you're a Platinum member, that comes down to 35920, because you get 20 percent off and you're gonna get 500 bonus points we used to see you know get an extra hundred or you know maybe double points 500 bonus points on top of this on top of the points you're already gonna get for getting the machine I mean seriously so if you were a brand new customer let me get this right you yep. get your 499 points yep plus 500 extra yeah 949 oh. yeah 949 points so you're well into gold category there, aren't you? Uh, yes, and Al the rest. Almost. <laughs> yes, you are absolutely right. And the thing is, yeah, this is, this is, hey, we got, we're looking after you. It's not every day we launch a new machine like this, is it not? In fact, it's, it's not even every year we launch no. a new machine like this. Uh, this has been absolutely years in the making. So, right, all I'm doing here, Ben, is I'm just scoring that middle line and then out there. This is this is what you're going to use your pro for. You're going to be positioning yes. your dies. It's not about brand new big dies. Because for me, if that was the case, in all honesty, would I spend five hundred pounds on a machine if I then had to spend you know hundred pounds a month on buying more dies? Exactly right. Yeah. I, I, realistically, guys, I wouldn't. But for me, it's all this stuff. I love construction. You know, I mean, the the shows where I'm most at home, Ben, is where I'm doing all these fancy boxes. Yeah. I did some last week. I, honestly loved it and then what you've got is you've got all of these you know fabulous fancy folds you can do and now we can cut into them now let's have a little look let's get some lovely uh, lovely ribbon here and then some little porky tools now this is that sorbet cardstock ben 40 percent um, has already gone of it sarah what 40 percent of the sorbet has gone what well, th this is the launch today though 40 percent of the stock has gone yeah, but i you, told them to order extra of this because i said the colors are so gorgeous yep the, uh, right 40 percent right. i'll um, i'll give you a good little uh, run through of that in just a bit we'll have a, a flick through it but what i would say whatever you've got your eye on you need to grab it the comments are off the chart i mean so many comments coming through uh dale says morning ben and Sarah. what a great day to launch the pro because it's my birthday dale oh. what you want to do right is if you haven't already got this and uh you know maybe there's someone who's maybe not got you a birthday present yet you want to give them a little a little cheeky little nudge, nudge. A little nudge. This is what you want for your birthday. Um, the, th the thing is, Ben, I'm going to, I'll be totally honest, right? Yeah. And um, so when this sells out, it sounds like a when, not an if. Yeah, right? absolutely. Because we only had so many made and we've had half of that stock shipped to the UK and half shipped to the US, right? But when that sells out, what I'm telling you will happen is by the time we reorder them, they manufacture them. Bear in mind, the factories aren't open at the moment, so they'll take our order in early March. Uh, it takes a long time to make these machines. You could be talking between 
four and six, seven months before we're back in stock of it. We thought we'd ordered enough stock to last us through that six month period. The way, based on how many of you have pre-ordered this alone, HSN sold out in the day. Create and Craft, uh, we're at 85% of the stock wow. when I left about half past seven this morning. We could be completely sold out of the machine in the next couple of days. So if you're sitting on the fence about it, um, honestly, well, you're just going to have to kind of hurry up and make, make your mind up because these sort of things, and we've got so, wait till you see all the projects I've got to show you. This is barely scratching the surface, Ben. Uh, listen, the excitement is palpable. I know all of our US viewers are, are getting in touch on the comments uh, and saying how much they love theirs. Uh, Jennifer just saying, and there's lots of chat about the uh, the video which we showed you. Uh, Judy just saying, can't wait to get the Big Ben. Yes, Judy. Uh, I'm going to save, save, save my pennies, nickels, dimes and quarters. This is a must-have machine. And yes, I will name mine the Big Ben. Judy, when you get it, uh, make sure you let me know because that will be a very proud moment for me. Um, Rose saying, every time I hear that video, I expect to hear Ben say, but wait, there's more. Uh, we're throwing in a chamois cloth too. Hey, Ro, today we're throwing in 500 bonus points, not your chamois cloth, much better than that. Um, I have the Gemini Pro, says Eleanor, and I love it. I went from the Gemini Junior to the Pro. I can't believe how much bigger it is. Yeah. When you see the comparison of how big the Pro is compared to the Gemini, it makes the Gemini look like the Junior, doesn't it? Absolutely it does. Um, and Robin on Facebook saying, was talking with a fellow crafter that I just met Saturday Saturday, she asked if I should get the pro. Absolutely, I told her that she would love it. Keep these comments coming in. Um, keep all of these uh, messages coming in as well, because uh, we have got so many of you watching, so many of you buying. Now, if you want to be able to do um, the Rick Rack, <laughs> it makes me laugh every time. This is a Regal Rick Rack. I think Rick Rack sounds like an 80s pop star. It might just be me, uh, but this is the Regal Rick Rack. Uh, as far as the stock is concerned on this one, uh, where are we, Aaron? What did you say? 70% of the stock of the Rick Rack has already gone. So it's absolutely beautiful for doing your edibles as we've seen, but also if you're making your larger construction uh, boxes like we just saw there uh, with Sarah, absolutely beautiful for decorating um, your boxes as well. 9.99 or 12.95, but go swiftly on the Rick Rack because that is flying out of the door. Now, the butterflies we've also got, hugely busy for the <gasps> butterflies. Where did I show you the demo with that one, Ben? Uh, we might have to be quick with it, sorry, because 70% of the beautiful butterflies has already gone. Get this while you can. We all know how popular butterflies are in craft. And again here, uh, this is absolutely stunning um, for your edibles. And again, like we said, if you want to use this in your construction projects for making beautiful boxes, then go for it. But get it quickly because they're going. 9.99 or 12.95. Now, something else. I'm sorry if I'm talking at a bit of a pace here. I'm, I'm feeling like I'm having to go slightly faster than I normally would because I'm getting stock updates in my ear the whole time. The sorbet, um, which we made sure we had a lot of stock of, 40% of the stock of this has already gone double-sided, 12 by 12. And like Sarah was saying, do you know what? This is just an absolutely beautiful color palette to go with where we're heading into. This time of year now, as we're heading through to the spring, as summertime arrives, gorgeous. Look at that with that gorgeous pearlescent sheen. 32 sheets of this gorgeous, gorgeous cardstock for uh, 19 or 24 95 Grab that whilst you can, flying out the door. The fact that 40% of a huge stock has already gone tells me just how busy we are. Now, I've got so much to show you here. There's going to be a lot of bending and stretching at this point because we've got all of the different favour boxes. So the collection is as follows. Uh, it, I don't know if it's easy to show you the boards or just show you the, I'll show you the board and then the box. So you've got uh, 30 elements within this collection. But I'll show you one board, right? So that you can see basically you get the die to be able to cut out. It basically gives you the base, all right? Shows you where all the tabs are, where all the folds are, and it just makes the construction of it really, really simple. Okay, so it's a case of popping this three machine, cutting it out, and then you can pop it together. With each of the dies, of course, you get um, a little embellishments to make your box look amazing. So this one here is your innate favour box, which is this piece of gorgeousness there. Let me leave you with that whilst I bend down and show you the next bit that you've got in here, your locking heart favour box. So once again, same thing that you've got your worker die to be able to construct the box and then all of the elements to be able to kind of add to the box itself and make it look beautiful. So that is your locking heart favour box. Next up is 
bend and stretch. Your country cottage um, favour box. Again, slightly, slightly different. Look at this one. Absolutely stunning. And think about these boxes, you know, for birthdays, for uh, weddings, for anniversaries, all of these things that we'll be able to do again in the not too distant future here in the UK. Fingers crossed that everything keeps going the way it's going. Also in this collection, you are going to get your handled favour box. Again, look at this. You think with uh, Mother's Day arriving, how perfect this would be. You think about um, Easter time, how perfect these would be. Uh, you know, just as little um, adornments and kind of, you know, um, ornaments for home. They are absolutely gorgeous. And then, last but by no means least, your origami favour box too. Take a look at that. So you've got the ability to make all of these different boxes. As I say, they all come uh, with a little embellishment to be able to decorate them all up. It's £75 or $90 the deal on that today. Already saving £26.94 or £29.70. <laughs> And already, 70% of the stock of these has gone. You guys are jumping in and grabbing everything that we've got. Seriously, there's a lot of shopping going on today. If you don't want to go for the full collection and you just want to mix and match, you can do. It's two for £30 or two for $35. It's entirely up to you. So if you've got your own a particular one, uh, then you can add those into your little multi-buy basket. Now... Pictures are flying in left, right and centre. Now, Regina has been batch making like you would not believe. How, yeah, how many Valentines did you send, Regina? <gasps> Seriously. Regina, that's amazing. Awesome. Oh, my word. Because you know what you can do, Ben? You just lie the die down in place, put the first sheet of card on, run it through, lift it off. Next sheet of card on, yeah. run it through, lift it off. Next sheet of card on, run it through, lift it off. Anybody who's batch making, honestly, I don't know how you'll manage without the pro. It is like a game changer. These look incredible. Regina, they are gorgeous. Um, Karen's been getting busy as well. I spy a <gasps> jigsaw die there. Karen! Karen, that is amazing. Now, let's just put this into perspective, Karen. How much would you have paid for that if you'd gone online and ordered it? I mean, you would have literally paid a fortune. I, I know I did one. I paid £18 for mine for a 10 by 8 die, uh, 10 by 8 jigsaw. 18 pounds that's about 25 26 bucks folks yep. and it is nowhere near as nice as that gorgeous one you've made karen karen that is fabulous so thrilled with that no no word of a lie it was as i say it's about three years ago uh, but 39.99 i paid for one that i sent off for for my daughter and I, ca I can't believe it when you can actually create your own now at home yep. um mary's been uh, getting crafty as well lovely oh, mary Look oh at this. mary oh is that the family mary that is beautiful and just look how gorgeous so she's done the scrapbook but use that die the one that's about to sell out <laughs> uh, across the bottom of the scrap the regal rickrack one how incredible is it when you can start and use your dies you have in your scrapbooking ben we've dreamed about this for years and just not had the opportunity to do that and, and you know what as well from the amount of people who chat about scrapbooking um this is an absolute dream i'm sure um and then from mary uh back to regina who's been super busy Look at this. Oh, lovely. Now, slimline cards are all the rage in America at the moment. Yeah. And you imagine you can now fit your whole slimline card with ways into your die cutting machine. I mean, it's just... It, it, Honestly, folks, if you are at home and you've got one, please tell everybody else what a game changer it is. Look at this next one from Robin as well. Look at this, Robin. One pass in the pro, everything cut at one go. Do you know what Suzanne... Oh, I think I did a rhyme there, didn't I? Um, uh, do you know what Suzanne said when I launched it on HSN? She called it the one pot wonder. You mm. know, like the crock pot that you can cook your whole meal in one pot on? She said, that's what this is for you crafting. Literally, die cut the whole lot on one pass, on one pass through the machine. Um, it's great to know that you're all loving this. Lots of you as well popping the um, jigsaw die into your basket as well. Pam says, um, I bought my jigsaw bundle, uh, a jigsaw bundle earlier. So excited. Uh, Lynn, I ordered both of the jigsaw die bundles yesterday with extra mount board. Why not? Um, and Mary's saying the jigsaw dies are a huge big seller. I'm happy that I can have them and can sit back 
and relax. So I think loads of people going for the uh, Pro today, loads of you going for the Jigsaws as well, which aren't even officially launching just yet. We're letting you grab them, but the official launch of those is four o'clock um, this afternoon. Stephen just saying, OMG, I can feel Sarah's excitement bursting through the screen for these new releases. Carolyn, I love using my Pro. Um, and Betty on uh, YouTube saying, love this die about the box we just saw then, uh, bought it this morning. If you are crafting with your pros, if you've done some crafting recently, send us in your pictures. We want to see them. We want to share them with everybody else. Uh, studio at crafterscompanion.co.uk. And if you are buying it today for the first time, uh, remember 20% comes off that price if you're a platinum member. So it comes down to 359.20 or 399.96. And bottom of the screen there, 500 bonus points. It's true. It's not a mistake. 500 bonus points when you take advantage of this deal today. Got some questions coming in, which I'll fire at Sarah in just a second, but let's crack on with another demo because I know you want to see this in action and I can see uh, what's coming up next. And this is going to be a great demo. It's going to be brilliant. <gasps> not, not that he's biased or anything, but I thought it was about <laughs> time we got out the jigsaw yes. guys and made our own jigsaw puzzle. 48 pizza, me and you, Ben, 48 pizza. Yeah. I took the liberty of sending uh -huh. for some photos. Yay! And I just sent away, you know these places online? I mean, you can do them in the local supermarket, yeah. I find, but you can just send your pictures straight from your phone and order them in whatever size. So I've ordered it on proper photo paper because I wanted this to be a special jigsaw. Aww. Just for you, Ben. Just Who's like, that I guy? I promise Ben he can take this home for the kids. Because, you know, they love me and they love their dad too. So, yeah. <laughs> they love me first, Sarah. It's me. <laughs> And then they but think you know, they like, think they you think you're they all really right. liked Crafters TV, so I figured they'd probably <laughs> love me the most now. My my Daisy uh, wants a shot on Crafters TV. I'm telling you this now. Like the, we, the more we're crafting together, you guys will have seen on my Facebook page the crafting that me and Daisy are doing. We've got the MIDI at home. We've been doing some stamping and uh, die cutting, and already she's going. When can I come on the TV? When, when can I come in and do a bit? I'm like, mm, well, maybe soon. We were chatting about doing like a little um, a section with the, the kids or maybe wake up call. Maybe get yes. yours in, get mine in. Why not? I think that'll be absolutely perfect. Now, look what I've done, Ben. We've done the packs of mount board. Anybody who's already got the jigsaw dies, by the way, yep. go and order some of the extra mount board while we've got it. We've done it uh, slightly larger than 10 by 8 pack and a slightly larger than five by seven pack so that you've got that. Did you see what I did is I maneuvered it. Yeah. That's pretty much maneuvered into place now. So that I, I don't get the little wiggly lines. I've smudged the glue all over the back, yeah. right? Now, do not put this through your machine now because what it'll do is the sheer volume of pressure in your Gemini, will just squeeze the glue out the end. So give that half an hour to dry. Right. I've got one. Another picture of you and me, the, the night we launched the Jigsaw Dies. Oh, actually. that was, yeah, HSM that preview. That was the night we launched the Jigsaw Dies. Ooh, don't we look smart. You do, he looks lovely. Does he scrubs up well? No, not too bad. All right, so I'm just going to lie that now over top of that jigsaw. Well, sorry, over top of the sheet and hold it in place with a couple of little bits of tape. Now, this is, I hold it in two places so it's not going to move. Yeah. Now, what I'm going to say is, you're going to, I want you to use this and I want you to add in the metal plate, right? And you're going to take your metal plate and again, that metal plate, we've made enhancements to these plates, guys. Like you'll see, all the edges have been folded over. So the metal has been folded over. So we're working on this, these enhancements for all of our Gemini plates going forward, right? Now, a little bit of a tip. This will fit in your regular Gemini, by the way, if you don't own the Pro. You don't yep. have to own the Pro to do it. But if you do own the Pro, what would I do? I like to tilt it ever so slightly like this, right? So that what happens is it goes onto the machine gently and it kind of eases on to the plate, right? So I pop that in. You pop your clear plate on top and then put the top plate on. Do not put the magnetic on, right? It's a multimedia die. So you do not need the magnetic, you only need the um, plastic shim. And obviously I've added that metal one in. Quick, um, Can quick. you hear? Oh, go on. You probably won't because it's so quiet, how hard it's working. You know with your Gemini, mm -hmm. when you put a really thick piece of material or you put like a really intricate eye, you hear it ha has to work harder. And I know you're thinking it's only a machine, Sarah, how is it? But what it's doing is it's drawing down more power to give the machine the power it needs to do that. That's what I can hear when I send this die through. Because the die, Ben, is absolutely massive, right? It's a massive die. There's, there's our jigsaw. Come on. Cut to perfection. Come on. And because we use that metal plate, look, these, I mean, they literally pop out 
to absolute perfection, that Ben. That is, is absolutely perfect. Now this, I'm going to pop it. I'm going to make a little box for it so you can take it home in a nice little box. You need to show everybody that amazing little box I've done with the stand on. Oh, yeah. Because that looks fabulous. I'll get this ready for you, Ben. Look, I could put you back together again. There's <laughs> Ben's chin and then there's Ben's head. Yeah. It's good when you get like the big ones because it's a 48 piece. You can be like, right, there's Sarah's eye, and then I'll just piece a bit of a mouth in here. And oh, look, it was till she'd been on air for hours, all her lipsticks rubbed off. You know, <laughs> it, you could have a right little giggle at them. But I mean, look how easy these are to do, Ben. And they are just, they're just fun. Whether you're someone who's doing this because you're starting a little business and you're going to make jigsaws and sell them, or whether you're just doing it for friends and family, like that picture that we sent in, which I thought was wonderful. You can take this home now for the kids. And now, by the time you you will tell those kids that I made this, not Co that me and Sarah together made it. No, no, you're going to tell them Sarah made it for them. Right. And then we'll see who's the favourite. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love this. I love like you're trying to become my kid's favourite. Can you imagine that? <laughs> we like Sarah more than we like you, Daddy. All right, break my heart. Uh, Trisha was asking about the um, the 10 byte jigsaw, but we've already um, answered that question. Uh, and I think you kind of... Oh, here it comes, look. Here I think, it comes. I, Incoming jigsaw. Whoop, whoop. Um, you, I think you have also answered the question which Will was asking about uh, angel policy on the jigsaw. I guess the whole thing about the jigsaws is you can make them to sell them as long as you own the rights to the photo, correct? You can say what? The jigsaws. Yes, of course, yeah. you, as long as you want the rest of the photos. Exactly right, yeah. And it doesn't have to be photos. No. It could <gasps> be a piece of artwork that you've drawn. But I love the idea of some of the work that the kids are doing at yeah. school at the moment. The and making that into a jigsaw puzzle. Oh, my goodness. Make the homeschooling more exciting. I mean, seriously, this is the best thing. I don't, I don't know if um, all of you know out there, but um, in, a, in a previous life when I was a radio presenter in the local town where I currently live, I had a roundabout named after me. That was always one of my big things in life, to have a roundabout named after me. No, no not really, but you know. Um, and the, sec the second thing in life that I always wanted to have done for me was to uh, be made into a jigsaw. So I'd like to thank Sarah right now. For, it's a um, big day, folks. Making... It's a big day. <laughs> possible. And just to say as well, with the this is the, this is the um, finished sample here that Sarah just wanted me to show you. How amazing is this? Because, of course, you can make these then gorgeous boxes to be able to pop your jigsaws into. So I saw this initially and thought, well, that's quite nice. A nice little, nice little box there with the... Uh, with with the little picture of the guys and it looks really cute but then when you open the drawer up you've got the jigsaw inside yes. come on and i just i don't know about you but when i'm doing a puzzle i always stand the lid of the box up yeah so that i can see what yeah. i'm doing this way you just stand it up on there yeah isn't that the best present you could possibly make someone i mean seriously you, you look at like you know with mother's day on the horizon uh you know with birthdays and things like that anniversaries like sarah says how amazing is that to be able to this is again breathing new life I always chat about this you know with, with photos nowadays you just keep them on your phone you never do anything with them do you this is a perfect opportunity like sarah says to get your photos printed off there's loads of companies out there that will print it out onto sort of photo quality paper for you uh, and then away you go these dies i just think are an absolute game changer the fact that you can you know um just take these and print off your photos and make these jigsaws i absolutely love and what i would say is what i would say is this jigsaw collection that we're bringing to you it's not even supposed to launch it we're launching this officially at four o'clock this afternoon uk time so in uh, just over two hours time we are almost at what 70% of the stock of your 10 by 8 jigsaw die and mount board has gone. Should by I the... tell you a little story, Ben? Go on. So we made the 5 by 7 one last year. Yeah. And we launched it in June or July. And it's just come back into stock and it's February. Right? Just, just putting that out there for you to think about this. If this is something that you think you might want, when the stock goes... That's not just the stock that we've got to do the special off in the shop. When our jigsaw stock goes, even with a reorder, I just asked the guys, they told me September. I said, that's ridiculous. We've got to be able to get it sooner than September. And they said, we'll try, but we can't promise. So when this stock goes, it is February. The team have quoted me before the show that it would be September. So I am going to go and kick some. What was it? Open a can of whoop ass. I'm going to open a can of whoop ass on them and tell them September is not good enough because we are absolutely. <laughs> 
because these are going to I don't know if you can today. say that at 1.48 <laughs> in the afternoon. I don't know if you're allowed to open up a can of whoop ass at this time. <laughs> I'll open a can of whoop ass at you in a minute. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I've heard Sarah say a lot of things and that is the favourite thing I've ever heard her say on a show. I love that so much, I'm, I should remember that. <laughs> right, um, there's loads of you, right, as there is much, as much love for the Gemini Pro as there is for the Jigsaws. Sherry Lewis on YouTube is saying, I've been making puzzles of all sorts of things, I need a lifetime supply of mount board. With the Jigsaws, do you know what, I love Sarah's idea again because you just think photos, 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 why not? You know, if your kids love to do their colouring, your kids love to do their um, drawing, I've had an idea. yeah. Take out, take out the, um, the, the the drawings that they've got and make them into jigsaws. They will love that. Um, Carolyn just saying, I love using my pro. Um, Maureen saying, exciting news about the uh, the plates. Yes, of course, we were chatting about that a little bit earlier on. Lots of exciting about this turntable as well. Not available yet, of course, but um, it will be here very soon. Do not worry about that. Um, and Laura Jones on Facebook just saying, just taken delivery uh, of my ultimate. I finally decided to order. Happy days. Right. The machine is flying out the door. This is flying out the door. Serious warning for me here. Get this now whilst you can, because I have a feeling as the official show, launch party show for this comes around later on, we will be down to the, the, the dregs of it. We'll be down to the last bit of stock. And I don't want you to miss out. The additional mount board as well, because people like Sherry who were just emailing then saying, you know what, I'm making puzzles out of everything, buying additional mount board. So that's gonna go as well. So please get this now, stock up on your mount board and do it before four o'clock because we could get to the point where we're calling limited stock at the start of the show at this rate. 49.99 or 50. 9.95 for the 10 by 8 we've still got the 5 by 7 available for you if you want to go for that as well but grab it now whilst you can and never like to sort of say you must get it now otherwise you're not going to get it but we we are at a situation where stock is flying out of the door right um i just saw sarah a few moments ago there putting her hand up uh, as I if i was doing this actually yeah this is, well this is more like what i was doing because i've just <laughs> i've just had an idea that's what i mean and i'm i'm going off piece right oh okay Look here we go what i'm gonna make here we go but i've had an idea of how to make something more special with it that I want to show you, right? All right, okay. These, uh, guys, you'll understand this. I'm a little bit obsessed with photos. I take 50 million photos like a week. I'm always snapping photos of the kids and they sit on the phone, right? And what I did a while back is I started just buying cheap photo frames and then anytime it's someone's birthday or, you know, we haven't seen someone for a while, we just get one of the photo frames and put a picture of the kids in, drop that out and it means the world to someone. How about being able to turn yourself into an expert photo framer? That's all we've done here. Few photos, printed them out at home, expert photo framer. Now what you're going to need for this, right? I've got some of A3 mount board here, right? And I know you're all going to ask us, where can I get A3 mount board? You can get it from all your local stores. Uh, I will absolutely endeavour for us to stock some A3 mount board because I know that question's coming now, right? I've got what you need. I see I've got them. Where have I put them? Uh, where have I put my large plates? So my 12 by... Here they are. You've got, um, you got so much stuff Ooh, over there, Sarah, here they to be are. fair. Right, Oof. you see... If you get the extra set, they come in this special little bag, right? So you can get the special little bag for them. I'm going to get the larger plates out. So I'm going to get the um, frosted and then the two clear. And because we're going to cut, um, we don't need the magnetic one, right? So what I'm going to do, Ben, is I'm going to take the plate here. And then I'm going to get, I've got some of our multimedia dies. So anything, any dies that we do, right, that are multimedia, so that they're these um, rosy gold coloured ones, and it tells you that multiple layers, they are perfect for your mount board. So I'm going to put in, let's have a look, we'll have the heart there, then we'll have another heart here, we'll have another heart down here. Now, this is what I'm going to do, Ben, which I'm a little bit more excited about, right? right? So I've got all of my hearts in here, which you can put all of the lovely pictures into. But then I'm going to get one of my other photos out. I've printed some of the photos out, the 5 by 7 Let's have a little look. Is this one going to work? Oh, yeah. That's oh, I mean, that's a pretty picture, isn't it? Isn't look that a great that. picture? So there is my, me and my hubby. Yeah. I think I'll just get that one positioned into there. 
Right, and at that one there, I'm going to hold in place with a little bit of tape. All the others, I'm just going to kind of leave them and just hope they don't move as they go through the machine, right? Is this a bit of crafty improv here? I did, I don't... Bit of, it, it, it is. Yeah, all will all right. become clear in a few moments, right. right? So I'm going to pop that one on the top. I'm going to pop this one on the top. So these are if you have those larger plates. And then this, hang on, I don't think I want you this far down. I'll just move, oh, don't, oh, you see, they're all moving. This is why you're supposed to stick them down, Ben, right? So if I just get all these in here, yep, happy with that. These are now going to go through the machine, and I'm just going to send them through. So this is, oh, my life. Ben, I, I might just stick this. You might have to stick them down. I can read some comments whilst you're sticking if you want. Go on. I think we're all right. I'm going to chance sure? it. I'm going to chance it. All right. Yeah, right. Here, oh, here she goes. Here she goes, being ever so careful, offering it through. Oh. Right. So, that's going to come through. Go on, I can still take questions, though. Um, I'm a woman, I'm fabulous at multitasking. <laughs> Kristen is just asking, you know the stencils and the boxes that we've got on the show? She's saying, are, any, uh, are there any stencils or boxes that are not included in the auto ship from HSN? Are there any stencils or boxes not included, included. in the auto ship from HSN? Yes. Like that? No, if you are in the HSN auto ship, guys, you are sorted. Awesome. And just on photos again, so Deborah's saying, will a normal thickness photo cut OK on the mount board? Yes. I think, yeah, because that, that's sort of normal photo yeah. paper that you've got there, isn't it, really? Absolutely. That you just put through. Yeah. So you don't, you don't need anything um, different to, to no. what you've already got? You don't need to. Not at all. Let's um, have a look. I'm just, I'm just getting this out here, Ben. OK. Because I'm ready. Th this, by the way, this was just going to be waste. So I'm keeping this now. I'm going to stick this on. I think you might be sensing, you might be getting an idea of what I might be about to do with this. Um, Carol Ann was no, just asking. <laughs> sorry, what? sorry, what? I said you might, this might give you a clue of what I might be thinking of doing with this. Oh, sorry, I wasn't listening to what but you were saying. But I don't think you've got, I don't, I don't <laughs> think you have um, I'm, Have I got a clue as to what you are going to be doing with this? Um, I don't know if I have. No? Yeah. No. I don't know if uh, I have. So I'm going to leave that to dry. I'm going to give that a few, uh, I'm going to give that 15, 20 minutes or so to dry. Yeah. Remind me to come back to it. But what I will do in the meantime is stick my other photos behind here. Go on, you can keep talking. So is that, so what you've just done there is, is something you're doing separate to what you're doing it's now? It's a bit of a Brucey bonus. Oh, yeah. Mm hmm. Bit of a Brucey bonus. What I've done there, I, so that, bear in mind, I've just used the tacky glue now to mm. stick that on in place. You want to know what I'm doing, don't you? What if you... What if you right, I'll tell you what. You let's just hope. I've, I've just broken no my own rule here, right? No clue. I, I haven't done this before because I've just thought of it, right? So, I've just thought... This is me going rogue. I thought... Well... Let's cut that with that. I just wondered whether that would work, though, with, like, a heart shape. I don't know. Let's try it and find out. Because I was going to sort of say, I wonder if she's making a jigsaw, but then in my little mind, I thought, does it, does it not need to be square or, like, rectangular? I mean, I know you can get, like, circular you know, ones. But... I'm about to try and we're about to find out. Oh, have you got to wait for it to stick down? Yeah, I'm supposed to. So, but um, but I, I, I'm, I'm, patience is not a virtue. I, I have, if I'm just being totally honest, Ben. So I'm going and to th by and... the way, this is one of those moments, because for those of you who, in, you know, who watch channels like this, you might think to yourself, oh, I hear it loads of times where they go, oh, I'm just going to go a little bit off-piste here and do a bit of imp improvisation. And you know full well that they've chatted about it before, and they're not really. This is definitely off-piste <laughs> and improvisation. We had no clue that this was happening. Yeah, it and might I, not. I, I, oh, hang on, I need the metal plate in, don't I? I think I we have no clue as to whether this is going to, um, this is going to work or not. I hope it does work. If I... it does, you're about to see me be really excited. Can't we? You'll be able to gauge whether or not I think it's worked yeah. from the level of excitement that we hit. All if right. it does, oh my word, I'm just going to tell you now, if you're not already checking out for the jigsaw dies, you better be getting checked out for them because if this works how I think it's going to work... Look at our excited jig, look. This is about to get really exciting, right? Right, right, right. come on, come on. So... So, oh, it, oh, I think it's worked. I think it has, it's worked. It has. Oh, right, right, right. So, I'm just savouring that moment. Oh, can you see, we've oozed a bit of glue out, right? This is why, folks, you're supposed to wait until it's, um, it's all done, right? So, if I just take... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we're just going to wait. It still work, though. It still works. It blimmin' right? has, you know. It so, has. It flipping has. It flipping has. Oh, right. I'm going to piece them together as well. Um, right. Yeah, you've t you've totally lost me now. No, it's fine. I d I'm just marvelling at this. I, do you know what? I, I was going to half suggest that that's what you were doing. But then when I saw the shape of the heart, I thought there's no way that you're going to be able to make a jigsaw heart. But obviously, just been proved absolutely 
uh, wrong on this one. Um, this is amazing. So many lovely comments still coming in. Um, Sue just saying, I'm going to turn my uh, colouring pages into jigsaw puzzles. Yes. Um, talking about my daughter's favourite person in the world currently, Lynn says, I think Daisy's favourite is Craig at the moment for allowing Ben to keep his Gemini midi. Hey, Lynn, I tell you what, I'm probably demoted to third now because it's probably, you know, probably Sarah number one now for the jigsaw, Craig two for the midi and me down at number three. So I'm, I'm going down the list very, very quickly. But are you just keeping track whilst I'm talking as to what's happening over there? Because look at this. Are you kidding me? She's only gone and improvised live on air and absolutely smashed it out of the park. If you need did any more kind of um, pushing towards getting the um, jigsaw dies then you've just had that big push because now you're saying to yourself well hang on a minute I can make jigsaws out of all sorts of different shapes I had no I had no kind of clue that this is where you were going but partly because I just didn't think it would work yes. and look I didn't know this. if it was going to work either Ben so um yes none of us knew but and this just to put it into perspective guys this was the leftover scrap yeah. from my other demo that I was doing. Clearly, that doesn't go there, does it not? Um, oh, here we go. It's, yeah. like, can, it's like puzzle e gate now. Can e Sarah do the puzzle? Easy to cut them out, not so easy to put them back together again. <gasps> now, I have got some little bits of... Oh, I'm absolutely loving this. I've got little bits of glue in my jigsaw, but it's all right because that doesn't matter. But they, for, do you know what? For a live on air, improvising, see how we get on... Round of applause. That is, whoop. you know, and just sometimes you're just so chuffed with yourself. And I, I, I can see from the smile on your face. Hashtag pretty fit. <laughs> ha hashtag bit excited. Hashtag smashed it. Hashtag. Yes, hashtag absolutely nailed it. <laughs> now I will go back to finishing said other demonstration. That, Brutie bonus, that I'm going to take as a lovely gift for my husband after we come off air. And, and I hope he's as excited as I am, because if he's not, He's, he's, I'm going to open a can of whoop ass on him, Ben, if he doesn't get that excited <laughs> I'm not, about I'm it. not 100% sure he'll be that happy with your choice of photo, <laughs> but I'm, I'm pretty sure he'll be happy that you've made a jigsaw out of him. Emma is saying, that love heart jigsaw is amazing, Sarah. Such a great idea. Um, there's so much love coming in. Um, that love heart jigsaw was amazing. I just said, love the puzzle die. I just ordered both of them, said Diane, and loads of love still coming in. Um, for the pro, love how quiet the pro is. Lots of questions coming in about the um, the jigsaw dies as well, size wise. Um, so, which jigsaw dies would go through which machines? Like Caroline, for example, has said, could you use the five by seven puzzle die in the midi? Uh, right. So the midi, it, the die is going to be a bit too thick for our manual machines. Right. You're going to want one of our electronic machines. So yes. So I would say. Yes, but no. In theory, the size-wise fits through, but you actually want the pressure of an electronic machine. All right, so for the 5 by 7 for your junior, and then the 10 by 8 upwards of, of that, and you need an electronic machine, really, is what, is what we are uh, saying. Details of your 5 by 7 on the screen there. Uh, 29.99 or 39.95. Uh, you get 20 sheets of your mount board included. There is extra mount board available for you on the website, and it's definitely worth stocking up, but uh, producer Aaron tells me that that is getting limited. Grab it whilst you can. Um, also, the 10x8 is available. Again, these weren't even supposed to be launched on the show. They're supposed to be launching later on. Is there going to be any stock left? That is the question. 49.99 or 59.95 for the 10x8 with your 20 sheets of mount board. Again, stock up, add more to your basket. So thank you for all these messages. There's loads of love coming in. The favour boxes you will absolutely love. Michelle just saying, uh, daughter's getting married, so the hard part is which to choose for favours as they're all so pretty. Get the bundle and get them all, Michelle. That is what I would say. Um, Angela Preston on Facebook saying, Ben, please, can you please, please, please thank Sarah for the apron she sent me as I gave mine to my mum for her birthday and now oh. she has sent me a replacement and I'm crying. You have such a big heart and love to all at Crafters, says Angela. Oh, I saw, I saw Angela posted this fabulous picture of her mum in the apron on Facebook and I just... She said it was my mum's birthday and I knew she'd love this apron so she'd save the apron to give to her mum and... I was so touched that she'd done that and I knew we had like a few spare aprons and I thought I'm not even going to tell her I'm doing this and I'm just going to stick one in the post. So uh, 
Mwah! I'm so pleased it arrived. Um, I love that so much. Uh, Katrina saying, Ben, I got my pro from HSN, just ordered more stencils and plates. So excited to use it. Coney Batista on YouTube saying, the pro is indeed a one pass wonder for die cutting enthusiasts. And Christine Thomas, do you know what? Um, it was last week, I think, when Craig did a scrapbook demo with the uh, positivity collection from uh, Nitwit. Um, and loads of you were saying how much you love your scrapbook and how much you want to see more scrapbooking demos um, here on Crafters TV. Christine just saying scrapbooking is why I personally purchase the pro um, I, I wanted to be able to use all of my dies on my pages and use them however I want so yeah if you are into your scrapbooking boy oh boy you are seriously quids in with this machine um, Yolanda is saying I'm definitely saving this live can't focus too much right now uh, just listening mostly hashtag kids yeah the kids, <laughs> the kids. can I just uh, put a DVD bed, on I was, them or something? Um, I was live on create and craft this morning oh someone mentioned that and the kids turned up because uh, so I was in for an early short half past seven this morning so yeah. the kids brought them in my dad always meets them at the office because my dad's on uh, my dad's on granddad uh, babysitting homeschooling duty today and the kids were at the window and they're like have you made our jigsaws, Mammy? So, it, it, look, this is. So, our Charlie, where's our Charlie's picture? Our, they sat and did, they watched my show last night and they sat and did some colouring and they were like, make it into a jigsaw, Mammy. Will you take it to work and make it into a jigsaw? So, uh, yes, this is our Charlie's, which I will make into a jigsaw in the later show today. And our Oliver's I did this morning live on Create and Craft, the kids were like absolutely cock a hoop. And do you know what? It cost pennies, Ben. Yeah. And the excitement that those kids felt at have I mean, I just think how excited I was when I turned my first photo, when I ordered it online and had a photo made into a jigsaw. We had one done for Simon's 40th present for his birthday. Honestly, he was absolutely made up. That's how I made the kids feel, turning their drawings into a jigsaw. They stayed up late last night colouring in because they were desperate for me to make more jigsaws for them. I just think it's amazing, isn't it? Again, one of those things, once the world reopens again, you know, you've got a little side business of, you know, making uh, jigsaws for people. They, you know, they can bring their photos to you and you can make the jigsaws for them. You know, maybe if you're looking to raise money for a particular charity, you can, you know, take photos uh, for that as well. And like Sarah said, if you've got kids, you know, uh, you know, with school fates and things like that, which I know will be cropping up again later in the year. And, uh, you know, a lot of schools, of course, needing the funds to come in. How amazing to have your own little store set up where you can make personalised jigsaw puzzles uh, for people. I just think it's fantastic. The Pro, by the way, is flying out of the door. UK viewers loving this. 4.49 or 4.99.95, less your 20% if you're a, um, a Platinum member, it takes you down to 359.20 or 3.99.96. And let's not forget, you're also going to get 500 bonus points with this as well. 500, not 100 like we sometimes do, or double points. 500 so if this is yeah if this is at your first purchase today for example 449 plus you get 949 points of this deal that is just phenomenal um it is insane producer Aaron. it really is listen um, you obviously get your 12 by 12 plates with the machine if you want to go and supersize yourself even more we've got the 12 by 18 uh, plate collection as well with this you've got your 12 by 18 magnetic shim you've then also got your um embossing shim with this as well your embossing mat is included your rubber embossing mat 12 by 18 you've then got your uh, two clear cutting plates and your uh, metal cutting plate and you've also got your plastic shim included as well so all of that uh, is in that bundle for 99.95 or 124.75 um, again saving 20 pounds today or 24.95 and um, if you are grabbing that you might want to go for some of the uh, a3 cardstock that we've got on the show for you too um, details coming up for you here. The uh, Centura pop. Now I've got this all down here in piles. Uh, bear with a second. There's so much of this. I've never done so much bending and stretching today, honestly. Um, the Pearl Fresh White. 50% of the stock of that has already gone. If you want to grab that, um, seriously, 20 sheets you're going to get. 310 GSM. It is really worth stocking up on this right now. These are also on a uh, multi-buy deal for you too. So any four for 30 
or any four for 42, 11.99 or 17.99 or four for 30 if you want to go for that 20 sheets. How gorgeous is that? And this is the kind of cardstock that you want to go with if you are going for your pro. We've got a whole host of other colors available for you as well. We've got your uh, pastels, we've got your ivory, we've got your hint of silver as well, uh, hint of gold in the snow white. Which one do you have a look at? Let's just show you, which one have you got up there? The hint of gold, this is gorgeous. I don't know. I'm making a right old mess here, but never. it don't matter. Tracy will be looking oh, through. She ben. won't mind. Hey, after the fuss I made yesterday, I nicked her credit card yesterday to do a demo on air. She ran out there going, can we borrow your credit card? Don't ask. Uh, um, <laughs> don't ask. We were trying, to, someone was asking about the trinket box, whether or not you could get like a credit card size gift card in there. So I thought, well, the best way to find out is go and grab one. So I grabbed one off, um, off Tracy. I haven't given the card back yet, but <laughs> the spending spree, it's been amazing. I'm trying to hide from her. Anyway, uh, 9 99 for your uh, hint of gold. If you want to go, oh, just take it out of the packet, Ben. If you want to go for this, can you, can you, can you see? Can, I don't know if you can pick it up on the camera. Just that little hint of... And of gold if in you there. ink onto that, or you print onto that, or you stamp onto that, because it's a crushed mica in there, the shine is still going to show through. You're inking, you're stamping, you're printing. That's it, what's so special about Century Pearl. It's it's one of those as well. As where as well, you, I can see that you can see the sheen there, but I don't think you can appreciate that hint of gold on the cameras. You'll just you'll just have to wait and see for yourself when you get this back. Uh, Nine ninety nine or fourteen ninety nine, and that is on the multi buy deal as well. Any four for thirty or four. There is so many of you watching right now, and I tell you what, let's give you time to check out your baskets because this is one of those shows, right? <laughs> where there's so many of you watching, there's so many of you got stuff in your basket and you're going, ah, I don't want to go away because I don't want to miss anything. So what we're going to do, and it will also give me time to do my jigsaw puzzle, uh, we are going to give you time to check out your baskets and check out your carts. And uh, whilst we do that, here is some information about our Club Inspire. By the way, 500 bonus points today. What does that mean for you? Well, this video should explain a little bit more. Welcome to Club Inspire, our free loyalty club. As a member of the club, you can save up to 20% every time you shop with us. For every pound you spend, whether it's in one of our stores or on our website, you'll collect one loyalty point. The more points you have, the more benefits you'll receive. As a welcome present, we'll give you 20% discount with your very first order. Once you place your first order, you'll be given 250 points straight away, making you a bronze member. This will mean that you'll receive a 5% discount on all of your purchases until the end of the next calendar year, plus priority postage. 500 points takes you up to silver membership, where you'll get 10% discount, plus free shipping when you spend over £20. When you get to 750 points, you'll become a gold member, which gets you a whopping 15% discount on every order, and will ship them to you completely free, no matter how big or small they are. Spend over £25 and we'll send them to you via our premium next day delivery carrier service. When you reach 1500 points, you'll become a platinum member, giving you the same shipping benefits as a gold member, but with the added bonus of a massive 20% discount on all of your purchases. Now on top of that, you'll receive exclusive discounts, sneak peeks of brand new products, special offers and money-saving vouchers. You'll have access to an exclusive secret Facebook group to meet like-minded friends, to find out information first and to be inspired by all the crafty makes. We'll send you a completely free quarterly Digimag direct into your inbox giving you lots of hints, tips, inspiration, additional offers and some sneaky behind the scenes gossip from the team. So what are you waiting for? Become a member of our club today. And that one goes there and that one. Ta-da! I just did that jigsaw in the amount of time that you were watching the, uh, the video there. Thank you guys in the gallery, Erin and George. I appreciate your round of applause um, for my jigsaw making skills there. Uh, wow, there's loads of lovely comments still flying in here. Um, loving the jigsaw puzzle dies that we've got. Uh, loving the machine as well. <laughs> Mariah on Facebook. I've been asking you, um, please if you've already got the pro to send in pictures of you with your pro and particularly let me know if you've named your pro or if you've decorated your pro. Uh, Mariah uh, did not have a name for her pro but she's now decided uh, Mariah says I've decided my pro my pro my pro is now named Whoopass 
Yes, I love it. <laughs> yes, Mariah, I love that so much. Um, Val on Facebook saying ordered, ordered. Is that the coffee run, Tracy? Yes, thank you. Uh, ordered the small. I'm so professional, aren't I? Ordered the small. <laughs> ordered the small jigsaw at the beginning of the show. Just to had had to go back and get the bigger one after Sarah's demo. Val, you will not regret it. Honestly, you will have so much fun with these jigsaw dies. Uh, gonna make puzzles of mine and my sister's puppies, says Laura on YouTube. Absolutely yes. cute. And Lynn, who's a teacher, Lynn Harvey, uh, lovely Lynn, says I'm going to use my jigsaws to make some resources for my class absolutely oh my word they would be brilliant. thrilled with that oh yeah. please send pictures when you do yeah imagine the day where you know you get the kids coloring or drawing their own pictures or whatever it might be and then the, at the end of the day you can take all of their pictures in the next day come back with jigsaws for all of them how awesome is that um studio at crafterscompanion.co.uk flood our email box with your pictures please with your projects um with whatever you've been making if you've been making with the jigsaw dies um send us pictures as well of you with your pro we'd love to see and keep the comments coming in keep the chat going i love it so much when you guys are telling everybody else why you love your machine so much why you love your product so much and particularly if you are a US viewer who's already got your pro tell our UK friends why it's so brilliant what you use yours for how you found it um, over the last few weeks since you've been using it let everybody know now we've got some uh, lovely pictures flying in oh um, yes look literally at this one, here ben. Carol yeah so Carol has been using oh they're one of my favorite dies we ever did that the beautiful create a card dies that cut in so she's done this gorgeous big box now what you can't see see just a little bit on the side of the box she's used the gorgeous butterfly edgeable as well which i'm going to use in my next demonstration yes and i just love it. The, to me that box looks so professional with the the clear bit of acetate in the lid and then that lovely big butterfly on top and then look at this other one that she's done as well is that with a rick rack now that's with the rickrack border this time mm. and then again with a lovely design cut into the top piece i just think to have big big boxes like that and cut in pieces look fabulous and then look at this one that karen's done where she's been able to use again that beautiful butterfly edgeable which i'm going to use in the next demo and with our big butterfly creator cards it's about super sizing whether it's your cards whether it's your envelopes whether it's your boxes the thing is you probably think well the gemini is really big it's nine inches wide already yeah but actually that's only if you're making a card that's nine inches wide what about if you want to do where you need like let's do the envelope right now if i've done a five by seven card this is the umbrella box for the five by seven envelope. This is just the umbrella box for the five by seven envelope at half an inch deep, right? Now look at this, if I take this now and I can pop this in. Now, if I want to cut into this, do you know what I think I'll do? I think I'll cut the butterfly design in actually. I think I'll cut that butterfly design in and I think what we'll do is we'll cut the butterfly in. Yeah. And I think, should I go sideways? No, I'll, I'll, go, I'll go across the bottom and then I'll cut a little bit of an aperture in. This is me freestyling again, Ben, right? Oh, here we go. We know so, what happens when Sarah freestyles. Oh, <laughs> we, amazing things happen they when do. Sarah freestyles on the show. <laughs> so I'm going to cut that butterfly in with the top edgeable as well, right? So it's just an edgeable. So all we're doing is going with your clear, your magnetic, and then your top plate. Okay. But it, what you've got to appreciate is, okay, the sheer amount of pressure. Because the machine is so big, it's got that more power motor it's got to have a more powerful motor to cope with what the machine is requiring to feed it through and give you the pressure you need the same pressure as in your regular Gemini but over 12 inches right so if I take this now the beauty with these is Ben is look you just lift them out yeah and I mean it Fantastic. cuts to absolute perfection now watch what I'm going to do here I'm going to come in please tell me I've got a knife yep so I'm going to come in. What I don't have is a ruler. So we're just going to do a Sarah Impro on here. So we're just going to do it as though we've done a lovely um, design up here like this. They call me Sarah Scissor Hands. I can be Sarah Knife of Hands today as well. <laughs> oh, right? by the way, Sarah, you know we were chatting the other day about um, crafty songs. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, we've almost finished one song which um, features you in there. I think it was Astrid who wrote the first verse to a uh, new song. So coming very really? soon. Really? Yeah, she wrote the first verse all about you. <gasps> it's to the tune of Am Coca I going to be next on the song? Because I'm not going to lie, that would make me pretty chuffed. You, um, there's three verses and you're the first verse of this new song. It's all about you. Yes. 
I'm yep. very excited. I'm yep. very excited. The first line is, I can remember it, um, her name is Sara. She is a glue girl <laughs> with glitter powder in her hair and full of crafty flair. That's the I first, love it. That's the first line. Her Coming name soon. is Sara. Uh, that, that she people? was a glue girl yes. with uh, glitter powder in her hair and she's full of crafty flair. And then it, I can't sing you the next bit because I can't remember <gasps> it. But yeah. Love it. Yeah. Guys, thrilled. Can't wait for this song to come out. <laughs> you made me a jigsaw. I'll write you a song. Yes, it sounds like a really good setup to me. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm going to pop this. Look, I've gone with the acetate and I'm going to put plenty of tape in these middle parts here, right? So let's imagine now that I've made a really gorgeous card that's got this butterfly edge below, like some of the ones you've just seen there, right? So you need a really nice card and now we're going to have an envelope that looks super uber professional. Do you know, bless our Liam, he's just brought me in a ruler. Well done, Liam. Yeah. Chop banana. Yeah, he's so good. What I need you to do, Liam, is be in my head and work out in about 15 minutes time what I'm going to think up and what equipment I might possibly need that you could then think ahead of me and then and then bring that equipment. Good luck, Liam. Yeah. Yeah, he's giving yeah. you a thumbs up. He's, to be, he's, he's to gone. To be fair, I feel like he's pretty close, our Liam is. Yeah. yeah he's, he's pretty close at being in my head. Quite often, you know, I'll come in for my shows and he, he is literally, not, he's not one step ahead of us, he's about three steps ahead of yeah, us. Yeah, he's good, lad. You all saw Liam as well a few Fridays ago on the wake-up call with Craig when he was dressed up to the nines for the... Uh, it was the blind date quiz, wasn't it? Oh, it was he so a, good. He had like a velvet jacket. jacket on, didn't he? And a bow tie. Very posh. Very oh, posh. Fabulous. Fabulous. Right, so, got my uh, tape down there. I'm going to pop the tape up the side here. So bear in mind, it's like, it's like all dressed up and nowhere to go, this. You've got the gorgeous envelope and I haven't made the card to go in here. But you'll get the idea, right? So, they go on to there. Fold these over. Ah. These come into here, yep. right? And I'm just popping these pieces in. Once this is all stuck down really well, this piece here folds over as well. And then you've got this lovely, fantastic envelope. But more importantly, right, I'm going to lift up these wings because you know yes. I love a good butterfly I know. with lifty up wings, right? <laughs> Have you ever seen an envelope this gorgeous? No. I'm just going to answer no, right? Because when you've got a fabulous, I mean, the, the card in there is going to look brilliant. Absolutely. So you imagine you've got just a plain, sheet, plain card in there. But with the lifted up butterfly wings, and I'm going to go one step further, I've got some of those butterflies that I've cut in another colour of cardstock, and I'm going to add them onto the front bend. Oh, yes, look at this. <gasps> Is this not going to be the most gorgeous card you'll have ever seen? Absolutely it is. And yeah, butterflies with lifting up wings are always the best ones. Can I just say, by the way, whilst you're just doing that and sticking those, I need to crown the title of Husband of the Day. And, Ooh, um, come on. Kay, you don't tell me the name of your husband, uh, but Kay, Kay Jukes on YouTube says, OMG, my hubby has just treated me to the pro 18-inch plates, big jigsaw die, extra mount board and a die. He is such a lovely man, I cannot wait to get it. I'm going to do jigsaws for all my nurse colleagues. Well, Kay, that is amazing. Uh, let me know the name of your husband so we can credit him properly. Yes. How lovely is that, Sarah? Uh, we are loving Kay's husband. Yes. Big shout out to Kay's husband. If you are anybody with a wonderful husband, we want to know about the lovely husbands. Yes. I get to hear about a lot of lovely husbands on Facebook when I'm chatting with people. I even have husbands sending me photos. I had one lady, a husband would be like Santa Claus. So he put a Santa Claus hat on on and, and there was a photo of him with everything he'd treated to that month, right? Oh, yeah. And so I said, oh, you should have got him to wear a whole Santa suit. So next thing, he puts a whole Santa suit on to send me a picture. Brilliant. Brilliant. But yes, we want to know about all the wonderful husbands out there who have been treating as well. Yeah. Because this is definitely the sort of thing that you can either treat yourself to or you can nudge, nudge, wink, wink. I'll have one of these early for Christmas. Might be February, but, you know, early for Christmas. So wonderful husbands, please let us know about them. Um, my wife, Laura, I'm sure will be uh, quick on the draw to send in details about how wonderful I am. Laura, if you're watching this guy, send in the, you know, the nice note. She won't be watching. She's a, she's a childminder, she's busy, she's, she, she's busy. I don't need her to send a photo in anyway, I know how great I am. Well, yeah, can we, did we see, I don't think we saw the finished, finished pro product, did oh, we? I was we too did, busy yeah. rabbiting. Yeah, yeah, did we see it? Everybody saw. Oh, 
<laughs> Everyone but me. I'm going to get ready, though. I, was, I wasn't even going to do the envelope. Do you want to see, Ben? This is it here. Can I see it again? Yeah, because yeah, I didn't. You look really nice. Here it I comes. Put it on the oh, you know yeah. I, no, I didn't see it on the closet. I didn't yeah. see it. Thank you. Little fold in there. Yeah. Just get it all stuck down nicely. Beautiful. Looks Thank amazing, you. doesn't it? It does, absolutely. Very professional. Very professional. Thank Trace you. Trace Profesh. Trace Profesh. Um, right. Um, what I was going to do, though, is I was going to get ready for a card. So how about I just take a second and yeah. get all my stuff out, clear okay. the die out, yeah. and I'll get ready to do one of the larger stepper cards next. Awesome. I just want to show you then. So the uh, the beautiful butterflies, you can still get. They are available for you on the show. Your uh, beautiful butterfly is edible. Over 70% of the uh, butterflies have fluttered by. So if you want to be able to grab those quickly as you can, absolutely gorgeous. $9.99 or $12.99. Um, if you want to go for that collection um, and the regal rickrack is also still available uh, this we saw a little bit earlier on i think it was the first demo that sarah did at the start of the show uh, and mary had also used this in her box that she sent a picture of us um, of a little bit earlier on that is also 70 percent of the stock has gone so 9.95 12.95 i would just say again and i've said it before already today if there's something that you want today grab it because things are flying out of the door who's enjoying this show let me know because i'm having the most fun um astrid just saying oh about the crafty song um yes it was so much fun so cool that you remembered it astrid i am going to record it i've written a second verse about um debbie robinson and the third verse i'm just working on so astrid it will be out soon and of course you will get a writing credit and uh, some of the money which we get for that when we release it and we're all millionaires wow um, I've, I've also got a song. Who was it yesterday? Dawn, uh, who's uh, started writing a song about um, Jan. So uh, Crafty Jan can to the tune of Candyman. I can't remember the exact words, but it goes the Crafty Jan can. You know that that song. I mean, I'm, I'm going to be busy on my days off. Uh, right. Martin, sorry, Martin, Martin Dukes, top hubby Martin. Uh, Kay's just got back to say that hubby's name is Martin. So big round of applause uh, to Martin, husband of the day. Right, keep the comments coming in. I need to remind you of something which is very important. We are changing our schedule or schedule. Do you say schedule in the US or schedule? You say schedule, I say schedule. Is it schedule? George, what do you say? Oh, you say schedule. Well, schedule or schedule. Uh, I'm not that posh. New lineup, new lineup uh, starting next Monday. This is hugely exciting, and loads of you have been so positive about this, and we're really pleased. Uh, basically, what we've done, we've had a little bit of a, a, bit of a shuffle around. So, 12 to half one is going to be the first show of the day, so 7 to 8 30 Eastern. I'll tell you about that show because that differs depending on what day of the week it is in just a few moments' time. The second show will be 3 till 5 UK time, or 11 till 1 Eastern, and then 7 till 9 UK, or 2 till 4 Eastern for the, uh, the third show. So, these two shows here, the 3 till 5 and the 7 till 9, those are are things like your launch day shows, your Monday maker shows, your uh, master classes, all these kind of things. All the shows that you know and love uh, are going to be um, sandwiched in here. A lot of people were concerned earlier on about this time. They would go, well, hang on a minute. What about the wake up call with Craig? Wake up call with Craig is now at this time. We've given uh, Craig uh, a bit of a lion and he's now going to be starting at 12. So 12 through until one, it's his um, wake up call. Myself and Joe will be dropping in to help out or cause havoc, probably more like it. Uh, and then the final half hour of that show uh, will be a craft vault. So there's lots to look forward to in that hour and a half with Craig. New time for the wake up call, but it's been such a successful show. Obviously, we were keeping it. We've just shuffled it forward a little bit and it's actually more of a wake-up call uh, for our US viewers uh, who are on Eastern time because it's 7 till 8.30 so it's perfect for you guys. Now this show time though uh, is uh, different on a Saturday. Well, it's the same time but different show. Play Your Crafts Right is coming on Saturdays between 12 and half one. So this is going to be a show where we get nice and interactive. There's going to be loads of fast-paced demos, loads of fun and chances for you to win as well. Each and every Saturday uh, if you tune in you could be walking away with a crafty prize and getting involved in all of the fun games that we've got lined up for that so that's on saturday that will be a lot of fun kind of what you want on a saturday morning really isn't it something a bit lively fast paced and fun play along chances to win and then on sunday you might be thinking to yourself well actually i'd quite like to ease myself into a sunday and this is where the softer side of life comes in again it's been great because you know what we've um kind of heard from you guys you've been saying what you've wanted to see and softer side of life i think a lot of you said you know what i kind of want to sew i kind of want to you know do my um, soft crafts on a sunday morning i, I really do think like soft 
crafts lends itself to that sort of time. So that is what we have done. 12 to 1.30 each and every Sunday with Bernie. That's the new home for softer side of life. So that is the full rundown. We'll keep you reminded of it all um, as we head through the next few days, but it all begins on Monday, all right? The new schedule, we're really excited. Uh, let us know which shows you're looking forward to and uh, hopefully, uh, you're going to absolutely love that new shady rule as much as we do. Thank you for all the lovely comments coming in. We're getting uh, comments about um, amazing husbands, which we'll read in just a few moments' time. You'll go a long way to beat Martin, won't you, eh? Hey, husband Martin. But let's get back to this. We've only got half an hour remaining um, on this show. The launch of the Gemini Pro here on Crafters TV. And uh, let's see this video, which is going to give you all the details you need about this awesome machine with an awesome voiceover guy. Supersize your die cutting and embossing potential with the Gemini Pro. With a huge 12x12 cutting platform as standard, this machine is perfect, not only for larger projects and batch making, but also for cutting all elements, mats and layers for your smaller projects in one pass too. The machine is capable of cutting through all sorts of materials, including card, craft metal, leather, wood, felt, and multiple layers of fabric. The power, pressure and performance that you've come to expect from the Gemini family of electronic die cutting machines has been enhanced to the next level. It's been engineered for superb edge to edge cutting of up to 12 by 18 size materials with perfect results every time. In the box, along with your Gemini Pro machine, you'll receive two clear cutting plates, a rubber embossing mat, a magnetic shim, plastic shim and metal shim, all 12 by 12. Power cord, plus of course your comprehensive instruction booklet that will guide you through the plate combinations you need for your different dies and embossing folders. Larger 12 by 18 plates are also available separately to boost your creativity even further. So, whether you're a card maker, scrapbooker, create paper or fabric embellishments, table decorations, wedding stationery, or keepsake gifts, to name but a few, this machine will revolutionize your crafting experience. Um, just to say, by the way, thank you to um, our guys who just reminded me, I've been so uh, wrapped up in this show and so excited I've not mentioned about the demo of the show we will be doing your vote for the demo of the show uh, in just a little while so we'll recap I've got loads of our demos to do still though first all right yeah yeah, yeah. so okay. the demo of the show we, we you know I mean don't get me wrong I've just all been right. getting my uh, all right. just <laughs> oh, oh here we go oh uh, here we you go know, now here's what we could do we could put that inside the box yes, yes that's what we could right 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 i'm going to get busy i've just put on a little piece of acetate so that it'll hold it in place i'm going to get busy with that uh so nudge nudge wink wink there's nothing to stop you making this demo of the show if you want to because that you know it's my favorite demo i think i've ever made well so even though sarah's still got lots of demos to show in the last half hour nudge nudge wink wink uh, get voting we'll remind you of everything that sarah has made in this show but i think that's the one that she wants to go on the crafty walk of fame um for later um there's lots of you now go, uh, nominating your husband's for top husband uh, because Martin Dukes is um, Kay's husband um, who bought her all that crafty stuff uh, Jean Snook on YouTube my husband Nigel bought the pro and 18 inch plates for me yesterday very early birthday and Christmas present can't wait for them to arrive I mean that is again so lovely um, Teresa Robinson Smith on Facebook saying I'm loving the new schedule that's brilliant Diane saying love the new schedule and that we all are still going to have to wake up with Craig yes we would not change that for the world and um, you get a line as well of course uh, Michelle saying my husband David watches and crafts with me we enable each other to shop and we share you're both enablers I love that so much and Betty Gray on YouTube look at all these awesome husbands being uh, being nominated my hubby Kurt says Betty is awesome I got the pro bundle both puzzle dies and lots of mount board well i tell you what hats off and rounds of applause to all of the amazing crafty husbands uh, and if you want to give a shout out to your husbands on the show let us know um, as well we are uber uber busy as we head into the last half hour of the show and these are the kind of pictures i wanted to see you with your pros renee loving your pro take a look at this that is a lot of love oh, right there I saw this on Facebook <laughs> when Renee had it delivered Renee loves her pro I think we all know it and then do you know what else 
I, so I saw Renee loving her pro. Yeah. But then I also saw this one. This isn't what I was telling Erin about. Machines. Look at that. Look at the beast. Literally, that is now the beast. Yeah. I think when you see it there, how fabulous does that look? Absolutely brilliant. That's what you need to do when you get the uh, the pro home. They call it the beast. Then you need to be like giving it a little face. If you can stick some googly eyes on it as well, that would be brilliant. Um, and uh, oh, here's a here's a face you might recognise. Who's watching the show? I wonder if you heard my impression of him earlier on. Uh, that is our Craig with a bit of a selfie. He's wanting the pro, Sarah. He's wanting the pro. I know. Do you know what? I had Fiona on the phone last night. I had Oof. Debbie Fisher ringing because she took hers. She took a pro home to work with a little bit. Was like, oh my word! I absolutely have to have one of these in my crafty life. She said I didn't think I needed it until I had it at home for a few days. Craig, you might just want to borrow this for a couple of days and see how you get on at home and then you'll totally see what I mean about needing one. Can I just say a big super thank you to our Craig? So um, so I've basically got a massive problem with one of my teeth, so I'm dosing on painkillers at the moment and our lovely Craig has agreed to come in and do the seven o'clock show for me So and I, and I text my dentist, you know, not that you should be on first name terms, but I would text my dentist, <laughs> said, can you, can you sort me tooth out? I'm in agony here. And he texts back and said, no problem. I'll stay late for you tonight. So, 7 o'clock tonight, going in to see the dentist. They're going to sort me out. So, oh, Craig's doing my show for me. So, mwah, love that boy. Hey, Craig. What did you say about him? What, did I say about Craig? No, yeah. I, did my, I did my impression of him earlier on, Do didn't I? Do your impression I? of him again. So, this is, so th just to tee this up, guys, this is because, so Craig's wake-up call has been so successful. You guys love it so much. And I feel beyond guilty that hundreds of you get up in the middle of the night in America to watch Craig on this show. So we've moved all of our scheduling back because the show has to start with wake-up call. So now Craig's going to do wake-up call at 12 o'clock noon, which is 7 o'clock Eastern, which I know is still quite early for some of you on the West Coast. But we had to fit it in before we did the rest of the shows. So uh, that is the precursor. This is what Ben had to say about Craig and his wake-up call. Craig said, aye, my wake-up call's a little bit too early in the morning. Can you put it forward to midday? Aye, because I don't like getting up and I want to lie in. Aye. <laughs> That's how he talks. That's exactly how he talks. <laughs> and somebody messaged him and said, is Craig Scottish or is he a pirate? Aye, he's a Scottish pirate. <laughs> aye. Can I just say very quickly, um, Craig as well, just, this is a little, just a, me and you thing here. Right, so you know Sarah said to you that you can borrow the machine, borrow the pro. What you might want to do is do what I've done with you. You know you said I could borrow that MIDI, so I've borrowed it and now I've sort of ended up keeping it. If you borrow it, you know, over time, <laughs> she might forget that you've got it, you know, and then you might just get to keep it on like a long loan. I'm just saying, it might be worth the conversation. Yeah, but then what's, De what's Debbie's going to say? Or Fiona or Jan when they're up? And they're all like, where's my pro that I can borrow if I'm borrowing the one from the studio? Actually, the good news is, though, the rate it's going, we're probably going to be sold out of our six months' worth of stock in a couple of days on the floor. Yeah. So actually, you could probably have it on an extended loan because we're not going to need it even in the studio because we're not going to be able to use it. Um, by the way, Craig is watching. He's just sent me um, a WhatsApp message which has about 15 uh, laughing emoji faces on. So I think he obviously loved uh, my impression of him and by the way just a quick one I think the photo we saw earlier on of the lady hugging a machine uh, it wasn't Renee it was Robin Miller I I've just been told. I thought it was Robin yeah I thought it was and I thought hey, I'm sure that lady's called Robin and I must have got it mixed up and I've called her Robin when I put it on there so ah there you go and it was Renee who's got the beast picture. Absolutely brilliant glad we cleared all that up what are we doing now then I'm a little bit lost as to what's going on right, right. we talk, talk about the prow, aren't we we've got Cards. some more demos Where, Sarah. Where's gone? Right so when it's a big occasion Ben you like to go or I like to go big yes. with the card. Now these are the cards that you guys know how to make we've done loads of these before I'm going to walk you through it. The difference is now I've been able to supersize it. So I'm just going to tell you, I'm going to use that gorgeous butterfly, right? So I'm going to use that gorgeous butterfly design and I'm going to use it with the outer cut as well. So here's the thing, if you want to do this exact style card, right? What you're going to do is you're going to start with a sheet of cardstock which is 11 inches square. So I've done 11 inches because I use the Centura Pearl, yeah. right? Now look what I've done, if I just show you all the measurements on here, okay? What you do is 11 inches, I'm going to put my score line in the middle at 8 inches here because I'm going to cut this and I want a little bit of a gap on either side to keep it connected, right? So eight inches and you put your marker. Then here, what you're gonna do is you're gonna go, ready? At four and one eighth of an inch, 
six and seven eighths of an inch, so one little notch before the seven, and eight and a quarter, so two little notches after the eight. You got that? So four and one little notch, then one little notch before the seven, two little notches after the eight, right? And in the middle, so if you flip this right over, at five and a half, you're going to put a little marker, and the same as you get down to this part here. That is the sizing you need if you want to do this exact size card. Now, watch what I'm going to do, Ben, right? I'm going to pop the butterflies on here, and I'm going to pop the top bit over the butterflies. Oh, okay. And move that up so that the edge part of the cut lines up with those score lines. And then just, I would say, let's go with two of these, just to make sure that it doesn't move when we're in the just lifting over to the machine it's going to cut perfectly i'm also going to use one of those lovely little dies down in the corner here oh yeah because i think they look fabulous so i'm going to pop that in the corner there and i'm just going to hold this in place with a little bit of a little bit of tape and then that is ready to go through the machine now all if you've just kind of watched us part way through you're just cutting into the base machine you're going with your magnetic your clear plastic shim and your top plate, just as you do with your regular Gemini. And I'll just tell you, the more you pick this up and start to use it, the more it just becomes normal. Like, like Craig says, he sat at home and all of a sudden his ordinary Gemini feels very ordinary. It's just because everything in the world ends up getting super sized. Like me, with the 75 inch plasma screen yeah. in the corner of the living room. I can't remember what life used to look like when I only had a 35, 40 exactly inch right. TV. Everything goes bigger, right? Now, one of the beauties of going bigger is we've had to upgrade the mortar in there. So the, the pressure that you get on this means that, you know, dies like this, it, 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 they just cut through effortless, effortlessly, Ben, right? So I put those cut lines in there so that what you get is you get that cutting around the butterfly, right? So it's going to cut lovely around the butterfly. And then this one's going to go down and up and that gives you the little bit of a step on the corner Perfect. right now i'm going to take this butterfly die because i want some extra butterflies out of here so if i just tap the tap the excess out of here and if you do get any excess pieces the brush tool if you've noticed quite often I've, spent, I've been spending a lot of time between between the demos just going through and cleaning out these dies. With if you want a free brush tool, by the way, that's part of our Get It Got It Good deal that we've got this week. You um, you get the tote bag, you pay for the tote bag, and then you get a whole host of goodies free. One of those included is the um, is the brush tool you're just seeing Sarah using there. So worth having a look at our website for that deal. There you go. Details are bottom of your screen. There we go. I'm just going to take a little bit of that. Um the other cardstock as well so these are just all them lovely summer sorbet colors that we have okay and i'm just going to go again clear plate magnetic top plate is that Send the sorbet stuff. cardstock again That's using sorbet summer card. sorbet honestly the mm. colors in that sorbet yeah. are absolutely off the chart do you want a quick they are yeah. gorgeous just whilst that's going through just a quick look. There you go. Those are the colours of the summer sorbet. Last I heard, uh, I think approaching 50%. Was, did we say on this? I think. Um, I think it was flying out the door. Approaching 50% of the stock of this has gone. And we had a big stock, let me just tell you, to make sure that you could all get your hands on it. So that is the summer sorbet. Uh, and almost 50% of the stock has gone. Right. So I forgot to use the outer die for this. So I'm just going around the outside and cutting it myself because, okay. you know, services are hands and all, right? <laughs> so hands. there we go. So that is going to give me a nice one. To, now, when you're sticking this over here, Ben, yeah. I want you to use your dotty tape pen. Yes. Because your dotty tape pen is going to give you loads of all over tape all the way over the back, right? So that is going to look really perfect, like a little bit of a window. Yeah, brilliant. There nice cut through and then with these here watch what we're going to do we're going to take that die and i'm going to just lift that off and then use i don't know where my little snips are so we'll go with the medium snips okay i'm going to use those medium snips and snip these butterflies out of here all right so you lift that one out there and then watch if i cut this out all will make sense you cut this bit out here and then you can cut the actual wings so the the die itself is designed with ultimate snippability, right? So you can get loads of kind of cuts out of this to be left with these lovely little butterflies in the end. Did you see that? So I'll do one more. Those edge balls as well fit in the normal Gemini, don't they? Lorraine's oh, yeah. Is, yeah, exactly. Lorraine's is saying, do they fit in the normal Gemini? Oh yes, they're yeah. just they're just beautiful regular edge balls, which I know you're going to absolutely love. Mm. So yes, absolutely. It's just the benefit is we can now cut them into larger pieces of cardstock, right? 
Okay. So there you go. You're going to cut yourself a couple of butterflies out. I cut a few of these out and then just put some um, gems up the centre. And then all I'm going to do, Ben, yeah. is a little bit of tape. And I'm using the regular tape, not the dotty tape here, to stick that in the centre okay. and line up the middle of that butterfly absolutely perfectly. So you can see just how easy it is to get all of these mm. lined up, right? Then in terms of the rest of the card, I've just taken nice and simple, got, got a nice bit of dotty card stock here, and I've, I've kept the card simple because I wanted to show you more the cleverness of adding all of that onto there. So we've got a nice little bit of matting and layering on there. What I have done is use the, um, oh look, I've got one of these ready with me gems on as well. I forgot, the thing is I got these demos ready so long ago, I'd forgotten what I'd got me. <laughs> so Super I'm, organised, Sarah, that's what we love. Yeah, Super organised. Go. So I'm just lining all that up on there. I think these look fantastic, right? So these are just the large, some lovely large format dies that we have. Um, I'm going to pop this on here. So we've got happy. And then you've also got, uh, I did have birthday. So I did have birthday to go with me happy. Oh, it's on the floor. Right. Oh, just, I'm, I'm going to walk around. You just keep talking, Ben. I will. I'll just walk around here and get me birthday. Um, there's loads of love coming in for Craig. Now, we've mentioned Craig coming back later on, by the way. And a uh, few people have said, yeah, Craig deserves a pro. He steps in whenever he's needed. Oh, Craig is such a team player. But Ro on Facebook has said, Sarah, you'll have to employ my 86-year-old aunt's Tupperware rule to your Gemini machines. If you take home food in her Tupperware, your name goes on a list on her fridge and your name doesn't get erased until you return it. So, that, now that so, is a really good shout. Yeah. <laughs> my, my nana used to be like that as well. With oh, really? My mum never used to return <laughs> it. Yep. So. All right, Ro, well, you're giving Sarah a good idea there. And uh, Betty just saying, um, she's loving the, um, the card that's being used in this demo. Um, yeah, if you're loving the colourful um, card stock, remember that is the Summer Sorbet collection. I'll recap on that for you in just a little bit, but just bear in mind that half of the stock has already gone because people have been shopping galore in this show look at this gorgeous oh, and gorgeous. remember so in case you forgot it was 11 inch square cardstock let me just get another piece so that you can see it off in the beginning here right it was 11 inch square cardstock we did the score lines at four and an eighth two, one little notch before the seven and two little notches after the eight right <coughs> so four and an eighth six and seven eighths and then eight and a quarter and then in the middle we put these little marks at eight, uh, five and a half. This one down here was at eight inches. And it was all on an 11 by 11 sheet. So that is how you make that beautiful card there that we're all looking at, that I think looks spectacular. It certainly does look spectacular. And um, we'll recap on all of Sarah's demos <coughs> in just a little while so you can get voting for your demo of the show. We'll do that in the next five minutes or so. It'll give you time to vote. Um, and now I touched on a few minutes ago about the Get It Got It Good deal that we've got this week where you do get the free little um, die brush. So let's recap on the whole deal for you. It's the Get It Got It Good deal. So here it is. Uh, you're going to pay $35.99 or $39.95 for the tote bag, which we know is super awesome because you've got so many pockets and compartments and it's a real sturdy bit of kit. And then on top of that, you are going to get your die brush, as we've seen, your metallic pencils. Uh, you're also going to get your tacky glue and you're going to get the uh, craft knife with the swivel blade and replacement blades as well. So all of those goodies are free inside your bag, which we know is super awesome. $35.99, $39.95. Get it. Got it. Good. That deal is applicable for the rest of the week uh, or while stocks last. Right, let's just recap on some of the other goodies on the show that you might want to pop into your basket to go with your pro. How exciting is all of this? Um, if you're wanting additional plates, um, the 12 by 12 clear plate and uh, <laughs> plastic shim <laughs> four piece uh, collection is available for you. Uh, Liam, Liam's just <laughs> Liam uh, has just uh, put, put his head in the window. Uh, he's got he's dressed like a pirate, um, a pirate because of my impression of Craig. I think that's the reason why you really don't want to see Erin. Uh, 44.97 or 59.85 for this bundle. And don't forget with this, you do get your free storage bag included. And something else that you definitely want to add, if budget allows, uh, you know, I'm, I'm not just saying, oh, you know, but buy, buy a 400 pound machine and shove in some you know, extra goodies. Um, 
you need to go for this if you want to, you know, kind of super size. If you want to do your batch making, you know, if you want to do your big box making, your scrapbooking, this is just going to allow you to take your Gemini Pro even further. You're going to get your six piece collection here, which is your magnetic shim, which is your, um, uh, your metal plate, your rubber embossing mat, your plastic shim, and your clear cutting plates as well. $99.95 or $124.75 is the deal on that one. Uh, saving $19.99 or $24.95. A huge savings to be had right across the board today. Um, if budget allows, do get that in your basket. Uh, and something else which you will want to add into your basket as well, I am sure, is this gorgeous summer sorbet 12 by 12 car. So it is absolutely gorgeous um, you're getting 32 sheets of this gorgeous cardstock with that pearlescent sheen as you can see perfect to use in comparison in comparison in conjunction with your um, your Gemini Pro but go swiftly on this stock up and grab it whilst it's here because 50% of a big stock has gone 19.99 or 24.95 is your deal on that one um, can we just quickly, I know we've only got 10 minutes left, can we just quickly uh, recap on Sarah's demos that she's done so people can vote for their demo of the show? Look Come at me, call, on, look at me we'll calling the shots that. from the floor. Very right. quickly, because I know you've got more stuff to do. Are you ready? So... Okay, so number one. <clears throat> number one, number uno, might be Fabulous Green Box. Yes. Right? Then we also did a bonbon box. Number two for right? the bonbon box. I also did the card. Number three for the card. card. call it card. Then I'm going to oh, lump these two together. Yes. So then you've got the um, the heart jigsaw with the envelope box. Well, we know yeah. what the winner is now already, don't we? That's four. That's awesome. I'm not I'm a betting so man. Tough. If you missed that demo, guys, that was a happy accident on the show. Oh, actually, that's an extra because I also did the mount board. Oh, yeah. So this was when I was doing my own photo frame, right? So I was basically showing everybody how to do this. This is the one that we did. Um, and then when I cut the heart out in the middle, I decided to cut the photo at the same time and then made that with the jigsaw dies all the time. You're not even supposed to see the jigsaw dies. So they're not supposed to be coming up till the four o'clock show this afternoon. And I've got some even different techniques to show you with them in the four o'clock show. This was just a bit of a you know, sneak preview. Little nudge. So there you go, that was five. Uh, four if you like the, the, the jigsaw heart um, with the um, embello envelope. Uh, included as well. Oh, that's going to win, isn't it, really? I uh, love the card stock, says Jacqueline. Just ordered two extra pads. Get it, uh, great get it deal, says Laurie. And uh, Booper92200 on YouTube says, Ooga, Ooga. She doesn't say that, I said that. Uh, awesome hubby alert. Turning 50 in July, and he just ordered the pro and extra plates and puzzle die for my birthday. There are some awesome hubbies out there today. Uh, thank you for all of those. 10 minutes remaining on the show then. So we're going to have a recap of the Gemini Pro. Don't forget, it's uh, the first time you've seen it here on Crafters TV. 449 uh, or 499.95. 20% off that if you're platinum. It brings that down to 359.20 here in the UK or 399.96. Uh, you get all of the plates you need to get going with it. And 500 bonus points. 500! 500, 500 bonus points when you grab this today. Do not miss out. If you've got it in your basket, get it checked out. Um, it is flying off the shelves and I'm not surprised. Right, final 10 minutes. What can you show us, Sarah? Yes, well, just remember, it's just the final 10 minutes of this show. Yes. So I'm going to be coming up. We're going to have an hour's break. Go and get a little bit of lunch. And Ben and I will be back to do loads more demos with the jigsaw. And I can get loads more demos done on the Brilliant. pool as well. So it's like another two hours. And then in two weeks' time, two weeks today, Leanne is going to be doing another full two hour session with the pro because there's so much you can do with that machine what you've had today is my interpretation and how i've been using it it's actually leanne who manages the engineers who've developed this i just have the vision leanne actually makes everything happen so leanne is going to be doing a master class on the gemini pro on tuesday the 9th of march so it's going to be in the same it's the same slot our first show but bear in mind we're on the new schedule from march so she'll be at 10 o'clock eastern time 3 p.m in the uk all those of you who have your pro can get your pro out be working along with it you can then be asking her questions you can be basically she'll troubleshoot live with you as well so today's your first look at it 
two weeks time this is what i love about here at crafters tv ben we've got all the time in the world yeah. to do deep dives into all of these products so any questions that you've got this this is not your only chance Think them up, message them in, and we can be looking at them in the next show. Or Leanne can be coming up in two weeks' time if you want to hear straight from the horse's mouth. Now, what I just wanted to touch on, Ben, because they will sell out are those extender plates, the 12 by 18. Okay? Yes. So in your box, you get a full set of the 12 by 12 plates. Those of you who are wanting to go for extra of the 12 by 12 plates, we've got them all in stock, but we've done a special offer bundle that just has the two outer plates and your um, plastic shim, because those are the ones that are taking the pressure. Those are the ones you might want to replace. With your 12 by 18 extender plates, it's actually not about replacing plates, it's about having a larger platform to mm. work. So something that's twice the size of your current Gemini plates. Now, imagine you're doing cards like this, right? Those of you who do wedding invites, or, oh, let's see if we can get that lovely picture up of the lady who did all the gorgeous Valentine's Day little, ba uh, oh, little yes. baskets. Oh, yes. Right? Now, what I do, bear in mind, to do this whole card all on one sheet. So what I did was, Ben, is I had all of these so there's my card with the rickrack die on here right and then everything else you need to do that card all on one wow so it literally becomes a one pass wonder and then all you do is and i mean actually i've taped these down so you can see them when i did this because i did a whole video showing everybody how to batch make i actually laid all of my dies upside down on the um can you see on the um, metal uh, the magnetic so that what you can do is you can put them all on your magnetic and then keep playing it through and basically you lie all your pieces in fact i'll show you that little video right so you get your pro ready and all you're going to do is you're going to lie them pieces out on your magnetic right yeah because they're all on there card stuck down send it through the machine right seconds through your machine take the first batch of pieces off gives you the base card with that cut in but then also all the pieces ready to go but the dies are left in place on your sheet so that you can then just go again with the next set so basically you're just batch making all of your card pieces and then the cards become something you can make in seconds so that is what i did with my card making but we'll get that photo up as well of that very talented lady who'd done all of yeah, those regina. Look at this. it was regina's wasn't it yeah look at all that i mean Brilliant. is that not the best thing for valentine's day and do it as i did lie it out on your on your base plate and you can literally be doing loads at once now when it comes to how you use your 12 by 18 plates he's the other way i do them oh hang on i've stuck all mine down here right so i love patchworking right as does our bernie right look at this what you can do ben is you can lie out you know you can fold your fat quarters over and yeah. lie out multiple sheets at once look how little waste i've got Absolutely. when i've positioned all the dies for two blocks so i've got two blocks worth here all laid out you you just couldn't because if, if you took your half size plate look you're cutting off loads of yeah, these yeah. dies in half so you end up wasting loads of fabric this allows you to get loads more fabric and actually our bernie did a fabulous project where she was doing a whole bag have a little look at this with bernie where she does the whole bag ben Take a closer look at the Gemini Pro. This innovative addition to the Gemini family will speed up your soft craft cutting in a flash. With all the power, pressure and performance you've come to expect from Gemini, the Pro can cut through all sorts of materials, including leather and multiple layers of fabric. But what really sets the Pro apart is its super size. With the extended 18-inch platform, you can layer all of your pieces for a single project in just one pass through the machine cut down the preparation time so you can start stitching sooner. Whether you're into your bag making or love quilting and want to cut all of your patchwork in one go, the Gemini Pro is for you. It is true, voiceover guy, voiceover guy, uh, that, you know, whatever your particular craft is, the Gemini Pro is for you. Just one more quick shout out here. There's loads of you now loving your uh, husbands and Diana. I mean, I know you love your husbands anyway. Didn't mean to sound like that, but you loving your but husbands. But we love them even more today. Yeah. Diana Densford says, my hubby Bob should get a mention because I showed him the Pro on my laptop and he said, if you want one, go ahead and get it. That was easy. So I told him about the 8x10 puzzle die and how fun it would be to make for our grandkids. And he said, that does look like fun. So why don't you get that too? So hooray for my generous hubby too. So that's Diana Densford, yeah. hubby Bob. Hubby Bob, hubby Bob, send in loads of love over there. In fact, to all the hubbies, because I've seen we've had loads of mentions for them. You guys are awesome. They know a way to a woman's heart. It's quite easy, Ben. 
It's through the Gemini Pro. Yeah, absolutely right. Um, listen, as Sarah's kind of alluded to, I, I kind of feel like today was going to be two, two separate shows with like the Gemini Pro in this show and then the Jigsaw dies in the next show. But we've kind of like melded the two together and we're doing sort of two two hour shows. So we will be featuring more of the Jigsaw dies on launch party uh, in an hour's time, but also the Pro will be back. So if you've got any more questions about the Pro, any more questions about the Jigsaw dies, then do get those in. Um, and also, you know, as far as comments are concerned, Concerned, testimonials are concerned as well do send those in uh, and let us know why you love the pro and why you love the jigsaw die too now before we just disappear on this show we've got the um, the small matter of crowning the uh, demo of the show and normally these are very very close I get a little note to say oh it's so close but today winning by a mile number one no not really number four <laughs> it's okay and that was a if you remember, those Happy of you accident. who were watching the show at the time, you need to go back and watch. I had this epiphany of an idea. And when I, start, I, I started doing this, right, because I was like, oh. <laughs> and then Ben was talking and talking. I was like, no, I'm dying to try this demo. <laughs> and then I got really nervous as I was putting it together because I was thinking, what if it doesn't work? <laughs> but it did work and it looks fabulous. And I'm going to go and take that up for my husband for a little present and then take it straight back off him and put it on the shelf. <laughs> well, there we go. It's going on the shelf. It could be crowned as the demo of the week uh, on Sunday. Just before we go, um, I just want to quickly remind you of our new schedule because uh, we've chatted about this. Very exciting starts on Monday, the new spring schedule. Here are the new show times, all right? So 12 to half one UK time, uh, seven till 8.30 Eastern time. Then three to five UK time is the second show, which is 11 to one Eastern, uh, and seven to nine UK, uh, or two to four Eastern. So these two shows here, the second and the third show, those are all the shows that you know. So your uh, Monday Makers, your Masterclasses, your, um, your launch days, launch parties, all these kind of shows uh, in here. This show here, Monday to Friday, is the new space, the new slot for Craig's wake up call, all right? So 12 to half one, uh, Craig will be joined by me and Joe on the show. He'll still be leading the show, but we'll be there to help him out. Uh, and then the sort of final half hour of that show, you'll be seeing um, Craft Vault. So loads of great deals to be had, Monday through Friday. Saturday, 12 to half one, is a brand new show called Play Your Crafts Right, where we are gonna be giving you the chance to get involved in the show. There's gonna be fast paced demos, there's gonna be fun, there's gonna be entertainment, there's gonna be your chance chance to win. We are going to choose uh, viewers who are uh, getting social with us on Facebook and YouTube. Uh, they're going to give you the chance to win as the um, presenter goes head to head with the expert in competitions and games and all sorts, giving you the chance to be a winner on that show. So that's going to be fast and furious on a Saturday. But then on a Sunday, we kind of think, you know what, I want to start things off easily. I want to ease into a Sunday morning and that's what we'll do uh, with Softer Side of Life, the new home for Softer Side of Life. Bernie will be with us 12 till half one uh, for all of your soft craft needs on a Sunday. Sunday. So we're really looking forward to that. New schedule starts on Monday here on Crafters TV. Uh, right, we are almost done. So, Sarah, you're going to go and grab some lunch and we'll reconvene in an hour, correct? Yes, and so what we're going to be doing is, yes, I'm going to be showing you some basics with the jigsaws. I'm going to be doing some jigsaws on some magnetic stuff. Ooh. We will, for anyone who missed the demo, now I love my little heart, we'll be doing that. I'm going to show you how to do a box to put your jigsaw in. If there's anything you want to see, just ask us. We can literally take questions live in the show, but the jigsaws isn't all I've got on. We've also got some of the fabulous Hunky Dory cardstock on the show. We've got an out of this world deal. We've got loads of stuff to go through and a little preview of something coming up later in the week. It's going to be amazing. Thank you, Sarah. We will see you back here on Crafters TV for launch party in just a bit. Bye for now.